I don't know, probably because Japan likes cute things. And so like anything that makes noise, yeah. But like America's like, fuck that. We got to be strong. Oh, wait, I don't know. I'm being play. Hey, guys, you're listening to episode 40. Three of Buffer Buddies. I lied. We're not watching 22 Jump Street. We're watching Talladega <gasps> Nights. Ricky Bobby story of comma. Um, because, because that was the reason why it was like, oh, I'm, oh, everyone else could introduce themselves too. <laughs> the one yeah, person. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm a Jury Aguria fan from Japan and we got painting all night and Seichi and Dim Butt in silence. So they'll be joining us in chat. That was my job. And you took well, it. Well, I did me. it. You took I it from me. It. You had no right to do it. that. Um, this but, is uh, a takeover. <laughs> it's Jury Aguria's takeover. Pew, 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 pew. Watch so out. I, I wanted to, we were going to do 22 Jump Street because like Tiffany's like, I love 21 Jump Street. And then she's like, I haven't seen it. And I'm like, what? So we we're going to watch that. And then like two minutes before we started this, I was like, wait a minute. It's kind of, she decided, she's the one who decided that we're going to watch 22 Jump Street last week. And I was like, well, why would we watch it without her when she picked okay. it? And it was kind of for her. So I switched it to the next movie on the, on the rabbit. So, I mean, on the, on the Reddit. So if that's the case, how come y'all watch Die Hard without me? Because it had it, because that was tied to Christmas. And you've also and it seen was it before. My Christmas movie. And you should have been here and for you guys, it. You guys didn't know I was Bruce Willie in Die Hard. Like, he is me, I am him. But, like, we quit because the next week would have been January. So we had to watch it. I know. I know. So bad. I had planned for like six months and you decided to leave. So no, I, no, 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 no. You knew I wasn't going to be there. And then you, you flipped it around and you're like, right. let's watch these movies. And then you're like, oh, we're doing Die Hard, Julia. I'm we like, did, yeah, we you did know, the I'm Julia's not be recommendation here. lineup that week when you were gone. It was the best. Yeah. Or yeah, however, you were great. gone for like a month or something. And I, I was like, so I was. I was so like when I was listening to that episode, I was all the questions you guys had. I was like, if I was there, yeah, I know I, I would have been really been them. great because like, I still don't. I don't know what I watched in that movie. I don't. Know, I was I like, like, oh my god. <laughs> so I use like tracked, oh. like track TV. I think it's a website that tracks what I watch, so I could sync it between different computers and whatnot. And um, so. Sometimes I'll download a movie that I already watched before. I just want to archive it and then it pops up and I mark it watch. So I don't, it doesn't show up on my, like my Cody. But what happened was, um, we, for every single movie in Buffer Buddies, like I don't mark them watch because I don't consider them watched on Buffer Buddies because I didn't get the full. Uh, so like I have yeah. to hard sitting there. It's like, you should watch this movie. I'm like, I should. I really should watch that movie. But also yeah. I don't want to watch them because I have visually seen them. I just don't understand them. So they're like in this limbo space where I don't want to watch them a second time. But I also haven't technically watched them. So they're just sitting there mm. un unwatched. So I have, a, I have a problem of like these backup of movies that are like, oh, I wanted to see that. But we watched it on Buffer Buddies. Gotcha. Yeah. And hard's one of those now. Anyways, I'm going to hit the play button. Though. Why is my mouse All not right. working? <gasps> Maybe mice and rabbits aren't compatible. Wait, Get yes it? they are. Because, <laughs> why? Well, yeah, they're both. <laughs> yeah, it's, like always, it's, always, it's always like, oh, <laughs> mice aren't vegetarians. They're omnivores, but the volume is always so loud on um, Rabbit, and I forget, and I'll have like my volume up on my computer, and like oh. it just blasts in my ears, and I'm like, Jesus! But yeah, then it's, I mean, it's literally just the Rabbit. Yeah, I've it like always turned. I mean, I always leave the volume on the movie Max because everyone could turn down the Rabbit mm -hmm. themselves and all that stuff. America is all about speed, hot, nasty, badass speed. Oh, also, I, met, I had a good segue and I ruined it. But Eleanor was, Roosevelt said that, by the way. Oh, good you job. You have to give credit for well, when it's due. I just remembered that I had a good segue earlier about me saying I dropped my popcorn. I'm, my snack for tonight is popcorn. Trails and then later on, I'm going to make cookie cereal, which is just cookies cereal with milk. So is that just like not cookie crisp? No, it's good because it doesn't taste like cookies. That's lying. Oh. Well, I've got coffee right now because I need a little bit of some coffee in my life. Um, and then later, um, I am going to make a snack, but I'll let you know what that snack is when the time comes. Yeah. Oh, so we're just but, keeping the audience but, in suspense. Yeah, we're keeping them in suspense. And then I might actually forget to go get my snack, and then they will forever be in suspense. It's very suspenseful. But yeah. Um... I was gonna say something and then I forgot. 
Oh yeah. So I assume, Jared, you have okay. seen Talad Talad Durstanites. Talad Durstanites. Yes. Talad Durstanites. Rick Burby. Yes. Talad Durstanites. Rick Burby. Shake and bake. Mm -hmm. House, ma'am. I don't yep. know what else you want. I when I also, like I loved this movie promoted. when it came out. Like I don't know why, but like. I remember like immediately buying this movie on DVD mm -hmm. and I was like, I must have. I haven't seen my dad. And my, oh man, I forgot. Like one of my favorite things to quote is um, on this. Just I'm high on Mountain Dew. <laughs> like my favorite thing. I don't is that the little, when they're like the little kids are just like, I'm going to punch you. And, like, yeah. And the grandma like, I can't gets control them. them. I can't control yeah. them at all. Yeah. Oh, and baby Jesus. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, excuse me, darling. I'm really Thank you, baby Jesus. Yeah. That baby Jesus line is like, Perfect. Yeah, baby Jesus, my favorite. Okay, real quick, does does little baby Ricky Bobby not look like Amy Schumer? Like, oh yeah, I think if I know who you're talking uh, about, a little bit, yeah. I, I I think they are the same person. I think that is actually Amy Schumer when she was a child in 2007. Yeah, somehow yeah. she aged like <laughs> that's how 20 life years, works, right? Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, I, this movie is great. Oh, by the way, I said I was drinking coffee for my snacks. Some of you out there listening might be wondering, wow, Julia, what are you using to drink your coffee? And I'll answer you that. I'm using a mug, which is awesome because it's an up-down left dye mug. Yeah, you heard correctly. An up-down left dye mug. Yeah, merch. Go ahead, get yours today. It's great. It holds drinks for you so you don't have to cup your hands and drink liquids from your hands. Hands. Like a filthy animal creature like thing. Like a filthy mouse like, rabbit. What, what do you call them? They use your hands and you're just yeah, like... Are you, you, and, and no one's good at that either. You? As you're scooping your hands, it's all leaking out. You lose half the, the liquid. And, yeah. And you burn your Stupid. hands. You get fifth degree burns from that hot coffee. Also, yeah, you get fifth degree burns. Get out. I, I don't even know what that if those exist. But also, those are going to go on sale soon. Um, they're going on. You heard the man correctly. They're going on sale. Like, go ahead and well, get yours they're, they're, now. They are on sale, but they are going to go on. How do you say that? They're <gasps> even how, more sale. Yeah, little, little cheaper. <laughs> I don't. Know. How do you? How do you? Because on sale and sale mean different things, and I can't words them correctly. There will be on, on. There will be a sale going on. What the crap? That means the same thing. I can't. How do you say it? So it means it'll be cheaper. So you've already got these mugs that are on sale right now, but guess what? You're going to get them for a bargain because they're going to be discounted. There you go. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that works for me. Whoa, who was that person that just came in and <laughs> Ricky Bobby. Who was Ricky Bobby? What's he doing in this podcast? Well, it's his movie, so. Know. That's true. That's, that's true. <laughs> but, um. Uh, but this cast, you guys. Wait. The movie. Oh. That was weird. It got all quiet, or like I don't know. Oh. That was, I don't know what happened. Now, why am I looking at you now? What's happening to me? You're looking. All right, am I the movie? Oh, I am oh, the movie. Oh, I fixed it. It was a Julian you know, movie for a second. It was. I thought was maybe <laughs> maybe this is kind of like a weird like a Truman Show. Of oh goodness. Could you imagine but if they gave him a computer though, and how boring that show would have been? He would just been sitting at it and staring at it, and like oh wow, he's playing WoW again. It would have died. Wow. Double wow. Yeah, double wow. Out of the fifth degree, degree burn, right? Am I right? I'm right. Yeah. Um, well, you, can't play, you can't go on the computer if you have fifth degree burns on your hands. You can't. So that's why y'all need to buy an up, down, left, down mug ASAP. ASAP means as soon as possible. Also, you agreed that the logo should be on the side of it and not like the front. I mean, for those of you who can't see me holding it right now, it's like a sneak attack. Someone goes, oh, wow, she's got a mug that doesn't have kapow. Just kidding. Well, I well turn my problem it. is because then you have to choose if you're right handed or left handed. That's, that's why I was saying you should do one here and then you should do a different like you should say the name like right uh, now. Up, okay. down, left eye. I like that a lot, too. Oh, that's those a much are always my favorite when I when what? I get mugs because I'm a mugaholic. I tell so, you what. Yeah, I was going to say. Should I do logos on both sides? But I like the idea of like the logo and then like our quote or whatever, something. Yeah. We don't like really you have should a have the logo and then Julia is the best person ever. And I'm mm. like, those will sell out. I don't, like, I don't think great. those will sell at all. We'd be lucky if we sold I one. Buy them. I, don't, I mean, buy them? my dad, my dad might buy them. My mom won't because she won't agree with it. But uh, well, then I'll make that's... one that's Julia is the worst person ever. And then your mom and dad She'll will both own one. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. And maybe we'll do Very like a true. thing where it's like the one that gets the most sales wins. I don't know what it wins, but it will, it will win. You know, like it'll we'll have a contest. Yeah, and we'll either I get like 
no, I don't want a hug because I don't want someone to touch me. I get like a, a googly eyed headset. Okay. To go with my googly eyed uh, <laughs> microphone. Or someone dumps out a whole bunch of trash and clutter into a room and they push me in and I'm stuck in there for like an hour. I like that one. That's a good one. It's like a room escape, but there is no way to escape. But you can escape, and it's just no, no, no. Sucks it's for you, it's Julia. Like, it's like Julia, this is room escape, and then we like throw you in there, and you're like spend an hour trying to figure it out. And there's like clues, but they don't lead anywhere, and there, yeah. it's just a deadbolt lock on the door, and yep. there is no key to open it. And you guys just leave me there, and then you actually end up forgetting about me, but. But I like the I idea because you're like, all I right, become... I, got, I got to get out of here. And you're like tearing open trash like, oh, it's so gross, right? but I have to do this to escape. And like, oh, there yeah. was no there was nothing in there ever. And then since you guys forget about, about me, I actually become the trash monster in Star Wars. And it oh, becomes I thought you were going to say Danny DeVito. You maybe be- I become Dan- Danny DeVito in Star Wars. He is my favorite character. <laughs> Like <laughs> he's, I he's love so it when Danny DeVito just like, though. right? Like y'all thought Yoda was cool, but Yoda's like brother, Danny DeVito, is even cooler. Like, yeah. Uh, so I saw coffee. Annihilation. What's that was a good that? movie. Movie with um, uh, uh, lady from Star Wars. Good segue. Um, what's her face? What? The queen. The queen. Um, not. Pam, what's her name? Dang it! Uh, the, the queen in the in the oh, prequels. Oh, Queen Amidala? Yeah, yeah. What's her face? Oh, um. Oh gosh, I Why like. I'm not I the remember. Biggest. It's Natalie right there. Portman. Natalie, Natalie Portman. Portman. What is this about? Like, I don't get any of. Obviously, these are going to be taken take forever to get to me if they get to me. Oh, but... annihilation. Yeah. So I think the person I went with said it was by the same person who made Ek Machina. Oh, it is. So, Sorry, I just yeah. posted up the, or I just looked at the poster. It is. So yeah. it is. Okay, so like, awesome. So it's just um, about friend zones. <laughs> yeah, it's just about that. No, it's a, uh, it's like this trippy movie about like change and just dis- destruction and like, like a evo- mm. little bit of evolution. Oh, that's kind of not like it's kind of like that thing where it's like, um, Arrival isn't about aliens. It's supposed to be about language. About which I disagree. I, yeah, I disagree with that. But that's what it's like. You know, that's what it's really about. In a way, same way. Like this is movie isn't about like DNA and like mutation. But like that's like the that's the delivery method. But it's more oh, about okay. like like that's the underlying message. The underlying message is more about like destruction and creation and and well, like change and like but not like physical change. Okay. Um, pretty trippy. It gets like really crazy at the end. Although like people are saying it's like whoa, I don't even get it and like like it's so confusing or like what does it mean? And I don't know. I didn't really have that experience. It felt pretty kind of like straightforwardish to me, but still mm-hmm. really amazing visuals and really good story and just like kind of like a lot of open to your own interpretation and it's okay. just like it's really cool. Um, although in a different podcast, they mentioned that they were reading, like some people were saying like it get it got so loud at the end that it like blew out the speakers in the in the movie theater and they watched like the last oh, 10 no. minutes in, in the dark or in the not in the dark because the movies are dark, but in silence. And then I was like so ready for it. It gets so stupid loud. It's so ridiculous. I don't know if I can handle that because like I'm at that age. Where yeah. I'm old and decrepit, and I have to put fucking like cotton in my ears to survive yeah. like it's, loud it's not, ass movies. It, it's not even music; it's just noise. It's like oh. literal noise. And it's so dumb because it was actually clipping in the movie theater that I was in. Like I've never heard wow. a movie what clip. Is the, what was the point of that? I just like super in. It's I don't uh, in, like um, suspense. Not suspense. Um, you know, it's, it was just trying to build. Like emotion, I don't know. It was just a. Mm. It was like way over the top. That's like one complaint was like, I get what you're doing here, but you're like destroying people's property. Yeah. <laughs> so it was really funny, um, but the ending was like something I, I. I was like wondering, like, how do they animate that? Like, who, what do you tell an animator like make in like? And it was just like, ending gets oh, crazy. Oh, like certain creatures or certain things that they had. Just like, like the three D animation was like. Who? It's kind of the same thing in anything that's like super artistic. Like you have a director, but how do you like the director is not going to go and do the 3D like modeling for that thing. Hey, he can't. Sorry. Speaking of Arrival, wasn't oh, it's not her. this actress? Yeah. Maybe that's she before she became it? a scientist. Yeah. Before wasn't she also Enchanted or Ella? Whatever. I always oh. get Enchanted and Ella Enchanted mixed up because I feel like they came out around the same time. What's the second one? Enchanted and then Ella Enchanted. What is Ella Enchanted? Which one's Enchanted, though? Is that the Disney? Well, I think they're both the Disney. Disney. It, the Disney one is Enchanted, where she comes out of the manhole. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just sounds so... 
That's the name of your porn. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, okay, so I Ellen can't you're just laughing at that or the, him speaking, trying to speak Japanese for the candy commercial. Okay, well, bo- bo- <laughs> that that's was really right. funny, dude. I forgot about that. <laughs> um, the uh, the Ellen Enchanted is um, with oh. Freaking licka licka. What's her name? Um, Princess Diaries, Double Wars Prada, and Hathaway. She can't lie. Mm. Like she literally, she's enchanted, Wait, so she is, cannot lie. Isn't that isn't that just Big Liar Liar or something like that? What is that movie with uh, Jim Carrey? Yeah, this, maybe. But it, it's something about how like she literally can't. Or no, 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 not that she can't lie. She has to do what someone tells her to do. Oh, is so that just Yes Man like, with Jim Carrey? <laughs> okay, maybe. I don't know. But it's not like a, someone just ripping off Jim Carrey movies. Maybe. But without the level of crazy. Yeah. I want some fried chicken right now. Like, that looked good. I ate all the fried chicken that we had, KFC. Oh, Stu, I took a picture of... I was driving through... Taco Bell. Taco, oh, can we just get... Taco Bell. Can we just live in this movie? They got Domino's. They got Taco Bell. Yeah. They got KFC. They got all the heart stop and power. Let me let me pull up this photo. So I was driving through like Westminster, which is like like a heavily like Asian culture area, right? Wait, was where? Westminster. Westminster. Oh yeah, because there's little Saigon there, so it's very heavily Vietnamese. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I was southern just... Vietnamese, I believe. And so, so much. actually, oh shoot, how can I get this into chat for you guys to see? Um, baby Jesus. Oh yeah, talk about something else while I do this. Um, they're praying to baby Jesus right now, and I agree. T- dear tiny infant Jesus. Jesus, dude, grow up. I love these. Ki- I can't wait. I'm gonna be so stoked when they're just. I'm home, about you. Like, <laughs> where are they? Where are these kids now? Oh, that's a good question. I'm gonna type that in. Leg- okay, wait. Let me I would harness love this, Tiffany. I would- where are the kids from Talladega Nights? If I was if I was them, that would be like my persona. I I, I go to school like I'm like I'm like 16. Now I'm in high school. I'm like oh hi man, dude. And everyone's like he said the line, but I, right? I, like, I would I would act like that to strangers just because I I could. I'd be like I was in Talladega <laughs> Nights. Could. F you. Ooh okay. Here I will send you. Oops. I found it. I found it. There actually is a um, a site that shows you what they look like then and now. Those are how fun. Invasion of privacy. Awesome. Right. Literally, are, there's one of them is sitting on a bench outside of a park. No, I'm kidding. He's not. Um. Oh wow. Okay. So the little redhead one is actually currently in the army. Hmm. Yeah. Um. Oh, I guess they don't have a picture of the other one, but. Brown haired boy. Don't Ricky. Oh no, maybe that's because it's. So cuddly, mm. but still oh no, no, no. Okay, so the redhead one isn't the one in the army. That's why there's no picture. It's the brown, it's the brunette is in the army, hence why they don't have a picture of uh. him anymore. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I cause, yeah. I mean, that's what I always figured. Like, if the people were just like in one movie and they fall off. Like there's yeah. no way you're gonna like be able to You're like, they're in the army. <laughs> yeah, in the army, it's like, okay, there's they're trackable. So yeah. All right, let me, I'm just cropping this photo down. Oh, it's all re- it seems really crappy. Mm-hmm. Speaking of Powerade, did y'all ever used to do this? Because I used to, okay. First, there, I need to tell you a little story about right. the kind of person I was when I was a sophomore in high school. I may not have been the most honest human being when it came to taking tests. I may or may not have uh, dealt answers for tests for my chemistry class. May or may not have. I'm not admitting to anything, but I'm saying it is possible that I used to be an answer dealer. Wow. Don't ask me how I got the answers, but I did. But my payment was snacks from the snack shop. And one of my favorite things. You could have got so much more money. I didn't. I didn't want to do it for money, but um, I wanted snacks. You understand how much I like food, and so what I would always like ask someone to do is to get me a Powerade and then a pack of gummy bears, and then put the gummy bears in the Powerade and deliver it to me that way. Because then, by the time you get to the gummy bears, they've soaked up a little bit of the Powerade, and they're so good. It's, yeah, pretty good. I, just, like, good. I, I always want. Well, the thing is, like. I'd always like put like a gummy thing in soda and hope that the flavor of the Ooh. gummy thing becomes it goes into the soda so it flavors the soda. But the thing is, it never dissolves them fully, and so either yeah, either like you drink it too early and then the gummy bears are just gummy bears or gummy whatever, or uh-huh. 
you do what you do, and you, by the time you drink it, you wait a little bit, and by the time you drink it, then the gummy bears are like Coke flavored. Or if you try to actually get them to dissolve, they don't fully dissolve, and then you have this weird, gross, slimy like sh- like things floating around, and it like is like the worst thing ever. And you're like, mm, this really backfired. Yeah, that's why I don't mess around with any like carb- carbonated stuff because then I feel like it get really messed up easily. But yeah, because yeah, it actually yeah, will like, dissolve even, it eventually, yeah. but not I'm very. Not even- Right, but I'm not even trying right now. But I, oh, oh, I've been saying it wrong this whole time. It's uh, I'm how, jacked up off Mountain uh, Dew. How embarrassing! You have like it's like ten years of embarrassing yourself. Everyone's like, "That's not the quote," but I want to correct her. She's um, so but you didn't correct me, so you didn't know either. I didn't claim to like love this scene. I'm jacked up. I like I'm high off Mountain Dew better. It's kind of funny because <laughs> it doesn't make. It makes less sense. Like how? What? I'm, I'm gonna keep saying it that way, Whoa. and y'all. I'm like so yeah. high on this coke right now. I guess that kind of does work. <laughs> Anyways, here's oh, this wow, photo wait, I took I of this even... this place. I don't know why. I find it kind of funny. So it's a KFC sign, but they but then they have it in. Do you know what language that is in? Wait, I'm sorry. I just looked at chat, and there's quite a few things. So I got I got confused. I don't know what's happening. What oh, okay. Mean? Oh, this is for... Okay, you posted the thing. The for... KFC thing. Oh, what, the Spotify the KFC... thing? Oh, don't look at the yeah. Spotify thing. Yes. And then painting said they don't appreciate it at all. They didn't appreciate it. What, what were we saying? Yeah, no. I didn't... Oh, Die Hard. Yeah, we didn't die appreciate hard, it. Die Hard, yeah. And then... Um, oh, I thought then, you answered the do you black drink your coffee, coffee thing. black? I do drink my coffee black because that's how I like my coffee and my men. Bitter. <laughs> I like my men bitter. <laughs> um, and the stickers on your and phone. You, and, and, giving, and, and they give you five degree five degree burns. They give me five degree burns. <laughs> yeah. So for those of you who can't, for those of you who are listening who can't see my phone case, I've got up, down, left eye stickers. That's right. Up, down, left eye also has stickers. But you know, I did buy some recently, and I never got those stickers. Mm, hmm. Must have got lost in the mail. Must have got must have got sent to Korea because that, that that tends to happen. I sent it. I put North Korea in the envelope. That's the right one, right? Yeah, that's the correct one. Okay, cool. Um, <laughs> Kim Jong Un is like, what's this? I don't know. What right? to do Kim Jong Un is like, okay, yeah. Okay, that you see a little. Well, I guess it maybe is a little bit insensitive, but you see the sticker on like a missile. Dude, you, <laughs> you're like, uh, uh-uh, that's not the kind uh, of uh, uh, spotlight any, we wanted. Any, any news is good news, right? Anyways, Ooh, can we talk about my yikes. picture. You know what language that is? Um, Kentucky. I just like that it like it's KFC and you're like what does that mean and then it's in a different language translating it I'm assuming in Kentucky and you're like but as I don't know I, I just I like the mixture of like Kentucky Ganchin. I don't I don't know um I don't know because so in French that's what the, that's the word for dog <laughs> I'm pretty I'm, sure I'm it's not, not like, French shin, though like, it's not French like, though but that's pretty funny Either way, I just like I don't know. It doesn't. I don't know. It's just it's translated uh, for them. I don't know. It's I, I just like that. Yeah, sign it's, a lot. it's chicken and Vietnamese, yeah. I believe. Yeah, but so um, is it just Kentucky chicken? Like where's like it doesn't it is, seem like there's enough words gat, in there for fried chicken. Yeah, probably means like fried. Mm. Where's Tiffany with her? She understands my broken. Yeah, fried chicken is is uh yeah Shen. I'm okay. pronouncing that completely wrong because so, I'm pronouncing the shin as if it's French. So that's what I'm except saying. my French friends would hate me right now <laughs> for the way I'm pronouncing it. So that's what it. makes it funny to me is like, okay, I'm an English speaker, KFC. I don't know what that is. And then you are um, whatever language that is. And then it's Vietnamese. Kentucky Fried Chicken. But you're like, what's Kentucky? So no one has all the pieces of the puzzle here. <laughs> so I just, uh, well, I mean, like, I feel like they would figure that it's just fried chicken of a place. But see, then they have more information than an English speaker. I mean, besides the obvious that I would know, living in America, I know what it is. But it's funny that yeah. they translate KFC to Kentucky Fried Chicken for them. But yeah. I'm just like, what is KFC, though? So, I don't know. Because, like, just, um, in Japan, it's actually in, in that, like, same, like, sense of logic where you're like, the fried chicken is the part that makes sense, right? Yeah. Because you're like, that's translated. But in Japan, you don't, like, it's... 
the same KFC like it's there, but no one calls it Ken- like KFC. They call it Kentucky. So no. they like people are like, oh, like Kentucky ni kitai. They'll be like, let's go to Kentucky, and I'm always like, that's hilarious. It, it's interesting because I'm like, y- yeah, like because like, and that's why like um, they you know certain ways like certain uh, prefectures they'll say McDonald's differently. Like you either say like the whole name or you just say like Mac or you say like Donaldos. And then, like, <laughs> I think with um, Starbucks, it's the same. Sometimes they say, like, the whole word or they'll say, like, Staba to, like, cut it short. Whoa, but it depends on, like, weird. what areas you're in. Yeah. I guess because they, they don't hear it as, like, mm-hmm. an English word. They just hear it kind of as a noise. So they could cut it short because it doesn't yeah, like, matter to them. Because yeah. people would think I'm insane if you're like, hey, you want to go to Starba? And you'd be like, what are you right? saying? <laughs> Where's like, the rest of the word? Me? Yeah. Like, get out. Get out. I'm and like, in Japan, a Mercedes Benz, like, you know how we say a Mercedes instead of saying yeah. Mercedes Benz? They say Benz. So if you if someone's all like, oh, like, I really I want a Benz, people, you'll be like. Some people do that. Not very common, yeah. but. It's, it's, you say Benz here while we say, like, Mercedes there. And then the jerk who says Mercedes Benz, it's like, you don't, calm down, dude. Don't be extra. Don't say the entire Porsche. thing. Porsche. Get out. Oh, Ellen's wife? She's so nice, isn't she? <laughs> Um, shoot, I had a I had a story now. I forgot it. Oh man, it was about words. That was my plan language. all along. Julia, um, take over. Step one. Oh man, I know it's oh it's gonna bother me. I'm gonna be quiet for a long time now. Look what you've done. Yes, I've I've done it. I've done it. It's just gonna be me and my country me, and, so, and your crispy popcorn. Can you hear it? That was a, <laughs> that like it was just once. Okay. And because it was like, I thought you had a potato chip. And I was like, did you just have like one potato chip? And you know I'll how like sometimes when you I'll get. I'll eat it. Like, oh, I don't understand. <laughs> that's a, that that's a, a death note. It, that's a, su- the dubbed okay. version of death like, note. Ooh. It's like way okay. over the top. Like the whole scene. That's the best scene of the whole show. <laughs> that's okay, all you really like, need is to go, to go watch that episode. That okay, I'll just watch that part. You're just like, I'll, I'll take I'll a chip and eat it. And it's like super epic, like drawing and like, it's all like crazy motions. And because he's like, it's just great. That's such okay. a good show. I'm, I'm going to rewatch that anime. Because the music in that, sh- in that anime is, like, so good. Yeah. Don't stop, Jared. Don't stop. Keep going. Pop star ain't never going to stop. Ne- stopping. Never oh, stop. God. Never but, stopping. Um, I was, I was going to say, I thought you had a chip. And I was thinking, like, is that the equivalent of, like, you know, when you order, like, fries and you get that one curly fry and you're like, holy shit, Ooh. fuck yes! I would like, love it you, if you my... like, pop your popcorn and there's <laughs> yeah. a fucking, like, Doritos in there I was gonna like, say the same thing. What? I love it I made popcorn and all of a sudden there was, like, always a one chip in there. Like, oh, it right? always spits out one chip for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. That would be fun. Anyone in chat, do you guys have any snacks you're snack a on? Uh, except for painting, because you said you, you ate a lot of fast food and then it's not agreeing with your tum tum. That's why you should drink black coffee, because it's not nasty painting. It's delicious. Delicious. I don't like coffee. Oh, no. Painting. Oh, I hope you feel better. But speaking of feeling like throwing up, I know that Carla doesn't listen to this podcast, so I can go ahead and talk about... Wait, did you actually Last say night. what painting typed? Or did you say, just speaking no, of throwing up? <laughs> <laughs> that makes no sense. Well, uh, painting said she feels like she's going to throw up. And then she said, that's what I get for breaking my diet. Karma. Um, and that's why I read karma, it, karma, but then karma, didn't karma, say karma, it. Karma, 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 The colors are like my dreams. Oh, there's more of that green. song? That's literally the only one I've ever heard. Said, I know I got a song. Uh, yeah, it is. It's by Boy George when he was in the Culture Club. It's an 80s song. I thought you didn't like 80s music. I don't, but that was on a commercial once. Okay, <laughs> once, and you remembered it? You yeah. saw it once? Oh, you know I, what I get really sad about? My Southern yeah. Californian peeps. When, because I do a lot of, like, references. Like, if Carla says something or is about to, like, finish a sentence, but she only gives me half of it, and it actually, like, I can finish it with, like, a lyric or with, like, a reference to something, I will. Mm-hmm. And she usually doesn't understand, like, any of the pop culture oh, references. Um, but um, she said one thing, and then, because uh, she was all like, oh, something, something, like, she needs to go buy a lemon. And then I was like, where you won't get, <laughs> get a, a lemon, lemon, I wouldn't have got a lemon. <laughs> and then I, like, did the whole thing, and she's like, what's wrong with you? And I was like, from Toyota of Orange. Uh-huh. And I got real sad because I was like, no one here. 
none of none of the Westerners yeah, it's a here. Very regional thing, I'm sure. Yeah. Like no one outside of like a 20 mile radius knows what you're talking right? about. And I was like, oh no. I think I did it, it on, so on on the stream once. And I knew yeah. no one would get it, so I was like, you won't get a lemon at I Toyota of, like, L.A. <laughs> Just, yeah, it's so good. That and, um, keys, 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 keys on yeah. Van Ice. I hate that one. Those I hate that like, one because I don't great. like it. But, I like, you can't not. You can't, it's, yeah. I hate it when something's, like... Marketing wise, that's really good, but I Isn't don't that like just it. Pop music in a nutshell, so, though. Yeah, yeah. But right? this is worse though because it's not even music. It's just like I going keys, 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 keys on Van Nuys. Keys on Van Nuys. <laughs> I want to shoot myself. It's also one of those things too. If you're like, if you're like keys, 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 and you stopped, like I'd be like keys on Van Nuys. Like I would have to like finish. Like you have to finish right? it. I know. I think we just cursed anyone that listened to this podcast. I'm sorry. We should just go keys, keys, keys. We should be the commercial, and then people listen to it and be like, I can't get away from it. I wish we had more listeners, because that joke would be funnier. But the two people are like, mm, I'm done with this now. <laughs> They're like, nope. See ya. I was going to say, um, and I, I, can't remember, I still can't remember the thing about the language, the, the, you know, what you're talking about when people say the languages. But there was another thing, I can't remember what we were talking about earlier, but I was going to be like, I wish we did have more listeners, though, because we could potentially, I have a potential space to do a live show in L.A., but I know no one oh, would, like, cool. come, and so it's, like, really, like... I mean, can you make it just, like, a, a down, left, die, hang out sesh? It's, it, but it's really far, so I, I don't want to make, um, make the trek just for, like, hey, three gotcha. people came. Like, it, we'd be lucky if even that. Yeah. But the, the theater owner, he, like, he said, like, oh, you guys should do the podcast here. And I'm like, oh, hell yeah. Also, there's a big, um, I mean, we'd definitely just probably fly under the radar, but we, you technically can't show a movie to, like, uh, people um, that aren't, like, in your house. It's a big, it's like a whole thing. Oh, I actually oh, found a website where you could, like, for churches to, like, get licensing to show movies for, like, movie night at like a church and it's pretty pricey i think it's up like it starts at like 500 bucks but that's like no profit you know and then if you want to collect yeah. money it just becomes a whole nother thing so yeah. just because it's not like it's pretty obviously not home use and then the legal thing kicks in and so even if we were like charging for it it's still like we can't show a movie to like 30 people for free and like you know yeah. so the whole thing gets in the way of that so it's like wow i really wish this podcast was like super huge because we could do that like it'd be amazing too like maybe once a month one of these is a live show out there it'd be so cool uh huh. Yeah, that would be cool. So if you guys uh, get your wait, friends when, to listen, right? Get your friends, you guys. Because what um, I think we would do. said if it was in oh. April, she'd go. Well, unless we could get like a thousand listeners by April. I mean, but what I would want to do is, it would still be the same thing, where like the people in LA would be live, and then you, Discord would still be over there. And all of our mm -hmm. voices would be coming out of the speakers, and we could have an audience, and they could have, like, you know, they could yell out some stuff or whatever. And the movie would be playing, like, <laughs> yeah, the movie would be playing, like, behind us on a wall, and I think that'd be so cool. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah. Oh. oh. Did you remember what you were going to say? No, I dropped the popcorn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm never, I'm never going to remember what that was. Oh, goodness. Ugh. I have been I kept I have kept for, yeah I've kept forgetting to tell a specific story to when Tiffany has been here mm. for I think well, the past her, just like, talk to her like she's here episodes. and she'll listen to it and she'll know. But I want to know her reaction. You could use this like like the notebook, like and you could trans like give her messages through the podcast, oh, I've and then she'll get them movie. in the future. I don't know the movie either, but it was on. Uh, how but you just referenced it, Jared. Is it one of your? Wait, no, I'm sorry. I, think I keep doing that. It's not the notebook. I keep it's the it's the oh. lake house. I keep referencing the lake house oh. as a notebook for some well, reason. Well, you would, because isn't Keanu Reeves in that movie? Yes, I haven't seen that movie either, though. But I have a pretty good understanding <laughs> what of what fuck? happens. Well, you know what? I can go ahead and now I know the only part that you should ever know about Death Note. And so I'll go ahead and yeah. reference it, even though I've never seen any of that. Stuff. Yeah, then go ahead. Oh my you goodness. do whatever you want. It's, it's the Internet. <laughs> it's the Internet. But speaking of the Internet and speaking about painting, not feeling well and speaking about my coworker, she had a fun. It's the guy from 21 Jump Street. Anyways. Yeah, Rob, Rob, Wriggle, Wiggle. Don't know his um, name. Wiggle, Wriggle, Wiggle with it. Um, 
We had, so yesterday was、um, my high school girls' uh, graduation ceremony. So the school year in Japan is、um, in the, it starts in April and then ends in、um, March. So the graduation ceremony was yesterday. And so s- most of these girls I've known for the last two years. And it was just like, it, I felt really proud of them to see them graduate and stuff like that. And I was really happy.、Um, and, So last night, the teachers, we all had an. So, an enkai is like a traditional, like, pr- pretty much translates to like drinking party, but it's not like people go out and then just have like 40s and are double fisting and drinking. It's like, it's an actual like formal dinner. I don't think anyone ever does that. <laughs> I don't know, man. But it's an actual dinner party. And so you go and you have like really good food, like, you know, really nice, fresh, like, Uh, sushi and like steak and all this stuff. And then、um, you basically go around and just like talking with all like the teachers and stuff. And I was a designated driver because、um, I'm fine with that. And, what?、Um, I don't believe you. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> What are you insinuating? Nothing. Sir. <laughs> Sir. You best watch yourself, boy. You better watch Lisa, yourself. Not me. Uh、uh-uh, uh, you're the one who was all like, I doubt that you were. No, I said I don't、um, believe that. And then, but then, like, you ex- escalated it. You made it. I, 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 so you went to this last part. I got onto the escalator and、oh, yeah. I escalated it. Yeah.、Um, <laughs> Next floor.、Uh, but yeah, no, so, yelling. Right? Yelling. Ah!、Um, I had. So Carla was like, because she wanted to drink. She's not a big drinker and she doesn't like beer, but the only thing that they'll have there is like beer. So I was like, all right, like, whatever. I'll take one for the team. I don't really care. Um, Wait, so she wanted to drink. The, all they have is beer. She doesn't like, like beer. beer. So then she made you not drink so she could not enjoy the beverage that was provided. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. And she's done that before, but like, again, like, I don't have to go and drink. Like,、yeah. I'm fine, you know? But it, but it still like, kind of is like, you know, like, like, we're going to chocolate like cake、beer. festival, <laughs> but I'm going to eat. You don't eat, but I hate chocolate cake. So let's. Like, And I know you like chocolate cake. <laughs> Makes no sense. Yeah. Yeah, I know. So I was kind of like, all right, whatever. But, um,. You still have to cheers, but they have like non alcoholic beer. Like, it's just to like have it to look like you're. Is it, you is it with the, everybody. Is it the actual non alcoholic beer, like Odul's?、Yes. Okay. Like, not Japan like. Japan is like serious. They are like, it is no、oh, yeah. alcohol. Is that's like、it? pretty, yeah, that, that's <laughs> Painting, pretty common. Pointless. <laughs> um, it's not pointless when Japan has no tolerance when it comes to. Oh, yeah, it's like、uh, DUI is like, you're done, right? Yeah, like, you, any, you any cannot、amount. have the, the drinking, like, the alcohol level is zero. Like, you are not. Yeah, a, and that's why even, certain things, like, you can't have,、um, you cannot bring. Uh, whatchamacallit here. I know it's not alcohol, but like just to give you an idea of like how strict Japan is when it comes to like drugs and alcohol,、um, Claritin, Claritin D from the States, if、oh, you、yeah. bring that to Japan, you could go to prison. It's crazy. Ty- liquid Tylenol, liquid Advil, you could go to prison. NyQuil,、yeah. prison. <laughs> I, mean, I, I agree with、yeah. the zero, you know, blood alcohol level because that doesn't make any sense. Why is there any tolerance for it? Make, it makes no sense to me in America. Where, but like, that's why, like, I'm saying, like, if you were to have like NyQuil or Have like accidentally like swallowed the serene. Sh- But that's the thing, you shouldn't, yeah, you shouldn't be driving with NyQuil and all that stuff. I, I think actually that will count as. I mean, I read, I, re- I heard, like, I read that's like. No, but if you like have allergy meds, that- like what Painting's saying, like, I need Claritin, and that's why it, it hit me so hard、yeah. when I was like here. I'm not and- just- Yeah. Because Japan does not have.、Um, because here's also the thing Americans, we love to abuse our medication. Love to go, like, I'm gonna go ahead because you can buy Claritin D over the counter. What does Claritin D have? It's got, you know, basically the makings of methamphetamines. That's why you can't buy a whole bunch and you have to, like, show your license to get yeah, it. You I, got, know? I bought a bunch of Sudafed and it was like the craziest thing because they scan, they like scan your, yeah. your, your,、yeah. um, it's, it works so good though. It's the only thing yeah, that and works. That's why, Everything else that's is crap. And you get dependent on it. And so you have to keep, that's why they have to keep upping the dose of all these things in it. And like, because like that's never an option in Japan, for someone like me who like, when I, cause like I used to have really, really, really bad migraines and I just kind of like live with them now, but also coffee helps.、Um, Advil, Tylenol, like migraine pills, headache pills, like I used to take so much. But none of the pain pills here or like the, like the quote unquote cold remedies here work for me. Yeah. Because, Because my tolerance like the, was so high. Because the same thing as like such crap. Like it doesn't、yeah. work. Like you know、um, what?、Uh, like contact? The、uh, old, 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 old cold pill? No, I don't. Take, it's really old. Like contact. Like I think 
my brother would have taken it when he was young but it's so old that that like is no longer like people could probably like snort that shit and nothing would happen to him in america that's the quote-unquote strongest like hold pill that they you can get here and then um, painting said i hate allergy meds i have to have them or i'm constantly sneezing and itching but they all make me sleepy which is why you you can't can't actually drive with those stuff too because if you do if you get pulled over it's technically still dui with anything like that um so you're not supposed to drive with that like in a lot of medications you're not supposed to drive can i give a pro tip for those that can buy sudafed over the 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 Uh the kind Uh we're not we're not this isn't breaking bad no 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 Uh, (laughs) first you smash it up and you you make you know you you boil it and you no Wait, um, you smash it up, then you boil it, I don't or know you boil how, it, then you smash it. I don't know. It? I don't know. I don't actually know. I can't continue to the bit because I actually don't know how to make meth. But it's not really funny. Follow actually, through, Jared. Follow through. I, I got hold on. I got to do a lot of googling right now in the dark web. Um, <laughs> shit. So, pro tip for like cold, cold, cold thing. This is why I, 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 I figured out this this comp- I might be I'm, I, so maybe don't follow this because I'm not even sure if these are supposed to be like mixed oh together, but it works so good for me. So oh, please don't. It's I'm scared. so I had like a cold and like nasal drip, Sudafed, boom. So that that kicks in in like 30 minutes and it helps like you help clear up your nose. But before, so I take that. Then there's um some nose spray. It's like the strongest one you could get without a prescription. Um, so I do that, and that gives me immediate relief. So that, that clears my nose right away. Sudafed will like help with the sinus pressure and like the nasal drip later on in like 30 minutes. And then um, a vapor rub on my nose. And that the, that combination, go, I could go from like the most stuffy nose to absolutely being able to breathe. And it keeps me like I could breathe for like more than two hours. It's worked so so good for me the last time I got sick. So scared you're gonna like call it's gonna be like the new Tide Pods and yeah. it's all oh, the because problem, of you. The problem with the nose spray is you're not supposed to use it more than like four times a day. So oh, I mean not that you'd need it with this combination. Is it, seems to is work it like a good. really, really, really mild steroid or it might be. I forget what the what the, the chemical in it that is, but it's like I was like researching it and it's like the strongest one you could get before like you have to go to a doctor for anything else. And they sell it in like a huge box so you can't steal it and it's it's kind of expensive. All that stuff is actually pretty expensive besides the vapor mm. of the Sudafed is expensive too. But I like yeah. Target because you don't have to like go up to the counter and ask for the Sudafed. They have little cards there, and then you can like pick it out first, and you bring oh, the card to okay, the, the guy, cool. and you just go this thing, and then he goes and gets it, and then asks for your your driver's license and all that. But I like that because I was like, I don't know what to do. Like, do I talk to the pharmacy guy and like I need pills? But I'm like, oh no, they have little cards. It made it so easy because they have different amounts. They have like a ten, a twenty, a forty. And I can see oh, the okay, price before, cool. I, and yeah, you can buy more. It's a little bit cheaper, so I bought like a, a rather, rather large box, and it was pretty great. Oh, this is the best scene in the movie where <laughs> he thinks he's on fire. <laughs> on fire right but yeah um <laughs> podcast listeners this episode was brought to you by allergy medications and stuff like take that it. So take a lot on, of it take all of them because take it for me because i can't take them here but back to take double for julia right take double for me but um this podcast is back, sponsored by right the pharmaceutical <laughs> okay, no, yeah. no. <laughs> um, uh, don't do anything so that we she, said yeah, don't please I'm not don't a please don't do. Yeah, don't. The only thing you should do that we have said for you to do is to buy oh. merch from Up Down Left Eye. Uh, Jared, Jared I'm, 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 I am a doctor in merch, and I prescribe you to buy Dr. that. Doctor Cats and Cats and Flocks and Doctor Cats, and I'm here to say that I love cats in a very big way. Oh Jesus! Did I rock? Okay. Did I do that rap on the podcast once? Yeah, you've done it. You've okay. done it. Never you've mind. Done Everyone's it heard it before. So please, yeah, everyone's already bought the single. We're I good. Can't wait for Halloween. I'm thinking I'm going to do that guy again for the whole month of October this time, though. I'm method acting. You're gonna get so math- method actor that you will become him, and I will start walking into hospitals and being like, "I'm Doctor Cotson." And what they're gonna be I... like, not this guy again. God damn it. No, and then it'll be like house and be like doom doom ding doom ding and I'll like you have leukemia and they're like I, what? I just came in because I sprained my elbow. Wait. Can I can I just like always be in the background? Yeah. It's never lupus. And I hit you. I just wanna do that. No, <laughs> I'm on that's drugs. abuse. <laughs> <laughs> because you're on because you're on Sudafed and, I have so much Sudafed. <laughs> I can get so much of it now. It's, it's not Vicodin for you, it's Sudafed. <laughs> It's like I always have a where, stuffy nose. Where's Doctor? Where's Where's Doctor Katz? And I'll be like, I think he's 
pop in the Sudafed again. They say I, I'm buying so much, people think I'm making meth. But then I'm like, I don't know how. I don't. I don't know how to right. do it. Oh my goodness. I want but to know. I'm bringing, it, I'm bringing it back before we digress so much. Um, Carla drank a lot, and then so I have. Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> We're in the, the middle of this story. Right? I don't know if the podcast listeners have been like listening a lot because like I haven't. No, been assume everyone's rushing. a new listener all the time. Okay, you're a new listener. So basically, um, I'm the type of person who, if there's big, big, big plans, I don't like to gush to the extreme about them until after I know 100% because I, I feel like I'm going to jinx myself. So like if it's right before a big trip and I haven't bought a ticket or set like the dates, I never go, I'm going to go do this thing until I actually, do you know what I mean? Like I'm, I like to follow through first and then I can go, okay, it's legit. Here's the news. So basically yeah, yeah, I've I been searching. There's so many times you're yeah. like, I'm going to do this thing. And then like, so how and was it? it doesn't oh, happen. I didn't go. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so I've been looking for um, a new job because uh, I'm 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 happy with what I've experienced at this company that I've been working for the last two years, um, and I want to move to Osaka. So I can now say that I legitimately have signed a contract for a new job, and they are in Osaka. So I have I'm really excited. So um, I the thing is though my company here has told me I'm not allowed to tell the schools I'm currently working at that I will not be here next year. They're not letting me say goodbye to my students or the staff, which I find ridiculous. And I can still upsetting. say goodbye and then be like, goodbye, and give them a hug and like, why are you being so weird? You're like, I'll see right? you tomorrow. And then you're right? just and disappear then I just forever. Never, yeah. see, and that's why like, I hate it because like, I've been with a lot of these students for two years and like my junior, my elementary school kids, I also teach the junior high school. I won't be able to, like, they think I'm going to be their junior high school teacher. Oh, and the teachers are even fools. asking me. Right. I know the teachers are even asking me like, oh, let's go ahead and start setting up like next year's schedule. And my company has been like, you are not allowed to tell them that you're not going to be here. And I'm like, here's the thing. I don't like you as a company, hence why I'm leaving. And two, I'm not going to be your employee anymore. So like I'm on this verge where I'm like, if something slips, I'm not sorry, you know, mm. but I'm not going to actively be like, screw you, company. Like, you know. But last night, I don't know how, but one of the teachers apparently knows and she comes up to me and she's all like, hey, so you're going to be uh, moving to a different prefecture. And I'm like, what? I'm like mid eating, right? Like, I'm not yeah. expecting this to happen. You and, so she totally... like, and you drop the fork and yeah. it hits a plate and like food like <laughs> falls out of your mouth a little bit. You're like, oh, that always happens when I yeah. eat. Um, and someone comes no, up to you with like I... shocking news. You're like, oh, it's great. Right? It's comedic. But I legitimately did go like, oh, uh. yeah. And like in that moment, she was like, oh, I'm like, this has been validated. Like now I know that you are actually, you know, like my reaction was one of, yes, how did you know kind of thing. Um, and so I was like, oh, shoot. So like when we're moving around, like I go up to Carla and I tell her and I'm like, hey, so I don't know how, but a teacher knew and she's over talking to the other teacher. So it's going to spread. So I was like, so you don't have to cause like Carla knows. And I'm like, so you don't have to worry. And I'm like, and if you want, you could do recon, like go ahead and like find out any details, you know. But I guess in order for her to find out details, she had to go around to other teachers and like drink with them. And she got so twisted. <laughs> And it was like, and I was like, it's fine. Like, I'll take care of you, you know, but she, I had to like rush her to the bathroom. Like she was like saying goodbye in mid sentence. I was like, oh, she's going to hurl. And I was like, just, just go to the bathroom. So we go to the bathroom, but like, as she's like up chucking everything, she keeps saying stupid and then whatever she's up chucking. <laughs> so she was like, and we ate a lot of food and she's all like, Stupid beef, bleh, and then stupid soup. And she I like, like how it's like I like how it's sectioned off, and it's all like it is, it, is it in backwards order right, too? Right? If you like, if you like salad, chicken, beef, was it beef, chicken, salad in that? And like, right? She has and like I'm four like, stomachs, and each stomach exactly. had to go like. And like as she's doing this, she's all like, "There wasn't even enough food," and I was like, "Bitch, you're throwing it all up. There was a lot of food. <laughs> like, please." And like she I was, was lying. Like, she was, just wants to like that way you could eat more food. Right. And <laughs> I she I, could eat um, more. I mean, she even stole someone else's food. <laughs> like she went by like someone's table and like grabbed a piece of the meat and ate it. And I'm like, Kyle. <laughs> um, but like, 
I was like, all right, I'm not, I'm not gonna like record any of this, even though it's funny. But then she gone and did something hilarious, and I recorded it, and it's on my Twitter. But she doesn't listen to this podcast, and she doesn't follow me on Twitter, so she'll never know. Oh, good. But she, um, <laughs> she like was in the bathroom, and then she kind of like slumps up against the wall, and then she proceed. Yes, I know painting. I'm a mean friend. Um, but she, I mean. I mean, it's funny if you watch it. It's not like I'm videotaping her like throwing up, but what she ends up doing is she starts to flick her forehead. And I'm like, Carla, like, what are you doing? And she was trying to flick the drunk away. <laughs> That's what she told me after. <laughs> and I thought it was the cutest thing. And so I had to record it, right? See you painting laughing. I was justified. So if you guys want to see that, it's on my it's on my Facebook or uh, Facebook. No, it's on my Twitter. Oh, her flicking. Um, the drunk away? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I go over and, here. And, How did I not see this? And so you you can barely hear her, but I'm like laughing and she's I'm like, Carla, like stop flicking yourself. And then she says, but I have to is what she says. <laughs> and I'm like, so I stop recording. I'm like, what are you doing? She's like, the drunk. She just fl and she's flicking her forehead hard, too. So but it, it was fun. And we got home safe sound. And then um. I, I the way she's standing in this video is so like the word like was she looks dead. That's why I was like, uh oh. She looks like yeah. like someone in um like Resident Evil like about the turn like that whole thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was definitely it looks very pale. Oh no, that's just because she's that's very just... pale. She's, oh, a she's very, very pale. No, she's white. She she white. Like That's she is. Funny. She's from Africa, but she white. Like she she is South African. But no, it's like she's been. It's like she's played hide and seek from the sun. If I'm going to um, <laughs> quote, who said that? I think was it Trevor Noah. But yeah, basically, she's been playing hide and seek from the sun her whole life. Pretty good. Hey, was that the story you wanted to tell Tiffany, or do you have a different one thing for her? No, oh, okay. okay, so the other well, you don't one... Have to. You can save it. it. You can save it if you want to hear But I feel like I'm going to forget, because here's the thing. So I said about how, like, I'm fi I am finally found a job with another company, and I'm going to move to okay. Osaka. I don't know what Sundays I'm going to be able to do, because I'm, mm. you know... Because my mom's coming out in a week and a half, and we're going to do some touring of the prefecture before I have to leave it all, um, and then moving in. So I don't know, to be honest, like... if. I, I'm pretty sure next week I'll be fine, but I don't know. I can't give definite, like, I'll be here in two weeks kind of thing. Well, I mean, oh, yeah, is it just because you're moving or whatever? It's because I'm moving. But after oh, yeah. I'm settled in and, like, get internet set up and get a damn table or a bed or whatever, then, like, I'm back to regular schedule. Um, but if Tiffany's here next week and if I don't forget, I think I'll say it next week. Well, do you want to leave like a, like a remind me, tell remind me to tell you about the Lynn manuel thing and that way then she, when she comes on, she'll be like, Julie, you're going to tell me about that thing. You can leave like a, a note for her. To, no, actually, wait, no, she, this? she won't hear you in time. Never mind. This yeah. is the delay now. <laughs> it makes it weird. Yeah. <laughs> Like, yeah. I don't even know what Julia junk is going on. Like, I forgot what happens. Yeah. Like, we didn't do it. One we did something else. I don't remember. I don't even remember. I don't remember what we did last week. And I, I like halfway through the week, I think I was like walking to work and I went, we didn't do it. We didn't rate the movie because <laughs> last week was just oh, me no. and Tiffany. And it wasn't. Very, I don't think it was very good. But that was definitely one thing that we totally forgot to do, because at the end, I was like, I don't know what to do. There's no Julia junk. Everything's thrown out of whack. And they were like, well, we'll just say our thing. We're like, all right, go find us on bufferbuddies.com. And then and then we just kind of like then we ended and I didn't even realize it until like the week. Like, so people are listening to this. We totally forgot to rate the movie. I think I'm pretty sure. Although I hardly I can I can never remember what like anything How from the previous dare. anything. Oh my God. What happened? How so anyways. Dare. But yeah, but I'm, but yeah, so there's a lot going on for me. Um, and like right now, I'm like, on over there. I, got a, I got a lot going on. Like I am kind of like, I've been like panicky the last like couple weeks because there's been so much going on with like the job and then moving because I like apartment and then all my money has been like drained out of my account for like getting this apartment. But I'm really excited. I signed the contract, but I have to send it in tomorrow. So I'm still like not even telling people like exactly like where I've gotten my apartment because I'm still like so nervous if something falls through, even though I've already paid for it, you know, because I still have to send the contract in. But um, mm. I'm like, I'm so excited. Like when I finally get to like say 
this is what's happening, you know? Well, can't so. you, did, you didn't you, though? You kind of did. Yeah, but, like, <laughs> it's still, like, I have the contract and I just signed it, but I have to send it in tomorrow because I still have oh, to get okay. something from City Hall. Once that sent in and once they get it. But even though, like, I have paid, so, like... Yeah, it's because I'm not in the same prefecture, so it's I can't do everything at once because mm. they have to mail me the stuff instead of me being able to go into the shop, like the real estate agency. But um, yeah, but I. Good news to come. I'm being vague now, listener. Currently <laughs> participating, but I'm pretty sure by next week I will be able to give everyone like indefinite information. And I'm super excited. As long as you guys know, I'm really excited and really, really, really looking for like this next moment in my life. That's all that cares. That all is all that matters. It's all that cares matters. Is the new job a teaching job still? Yes, 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 yes. Just a different. So the new job I can talk about because that's legit. I already, I already set that up. Um, it's a legit teaching job. It's not through a company that acts as the middleman. Uh. It's so I actually am employed by the school. It's a um, it's in Sakai City in Osaka, and it is so I'll be teaching at a junior high school and a high school. It's like a it's like an elevator school. It's connected. Um, they also have like elementary school and um, a university that they do stuff with. It's a pub. Uh, it's a private school. So one, the pay is better. Um, two, I'll actually be taken seriously as a teacher not just a joke it's not I'm not saying that the teachers that i currently work with take me as a joke but it's just my company they find ways to get away with telling you you have a full-time job but only paying you like shit pay mm -hmm. and then they don't pay you for the summer but because they force you to take a month and a half off you don't ask for that month and a half off the schools don't have that month and a half off, but for some reason, the company forces you to take that off and they don't pay you. So you get really, really crappy pay coming after that. And I've had nothing but like issues with this company. So I'm just looking forward to like actually having a legitimate like shady organization to work. Yeah, I mean, you know? like why have a middleman when you don't need one? Like, yeah, exactly. Someone's yeah. going to be, they have to make money somehow, you know, so it's always going to be. Yeah. And it's like they, they've had like a, a finger in every single pie, like financial pie that you've like dished out, like everything you can yeah, think yeah. of. Like I found out that like, you know, that the BOE actually, so the board of education actually gets a lot of money from the schools and they give that money to this company. And I'm like, mm, well then how come it's only a, a very small fraction of that amount that's given to this company that we end up receiving? Like, it's very shady. And the fact that this company forgot to pay me a certain amount of money. Like, how does that happen? How do you just misplace, like, $200 from my account? Like, yeah, yeah. like it's so it's so not cool. And, like, there's a lot of, like, BS that I've dealt with. But, um, you know, knock on wood, no matter what, like, anything new, there's going to be ups and downs. But I'm just hoping for, like, a good experience and something that I'm really comfortable and happy with. That's but, good. Yeah. So that was the Julia update hour on Julia's big, life. Big Julia. <laughs> wow, look at that, you guys. The movie's already over. Can you believe it? <laughs> Holy crap. No, oh, we're not even halfway. <laughs> Dang. Wow. We, <laughs> it feels like I thought we'd almost be done by now. Right? Maybe it was an hour and a half. Man, this movie. But you know, I do like the pacing of this movie. It has yeah. so many, like, it has like four acts in it, and they're all, like, very good in their own ways. I've always liked the movie, has good. Cause it's like he doesn't have the breakdown until like yeah around halfway into the movie in like I don't know it just it's 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 spread out well. Mhm. Mm yeah, I like it too. Um, any how about Jared updates? Got any oh. updates for you? Oh man, I'm so this is those things. This is one of those things where it's like, uh, what's your favorite movie? Oh. What's what are mo what are movies and then it's like what's your favorite oh, so what, like music? what's your update oh, what are updates <laughs> I don't know that like yeah like the second I have to think about it I'm like I don't know yeah, um, yeah. Uh, oh well my my work is we're moving so we used to work in we used to, our office used to be in Newport out of like an old bank building and that's so first so okay. founder guy pretty rich has like had like 
a house condo thing in Newport and the company actually started working out of that thing out of like this condo thing um, and then that became like in, like spillover like office space but then they moved into this building like across the street that was like an old bank and then I was working there for like a good six months or whatever and they were like oh we're moving offices and they said that for like six months like we're moving soon soon mm. soon 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 and then we moved into an, uh, into this building but we moved we moved on to like the seventh floor it was a temporary office space so it was just kind of like just set up for us but it wasn't like we knew we weren't going to stay there it's, while they were working on our office space on the first and second floor like uh-huh. renovating it so we were in this like temporary space for a long time and we just moved out of that and we're moving in first days monday into our own branded completely like the like google-esque you know kind of a thing where it's going to be all like branded well and like Ooh, the lobby okay. has like our tech showing off in it and like so people who walk in will see all of like some of our some of our platform with the ai stuff and i'm like super excited about that and uh, i was able to take home a desk for free and it's like a really nice <laughs> it's a standing desk you like, don't understand it's like an expensive desk <laughs> you just like you say it's like for free but you just like see a pile of desks that are there and you're like well i guess they're for free and you like are trying to lug it like under one arm as you're trying to like open a door i'm just like shoving it into the elevator what are you doing with that it's for free you're you're like no 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 it's for free it's fine i work here and they're like um no uh please bring that back we're just moving no 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 it's okay i got this one you go get yours and you just like proceed to drag it out of like the building yeah, but yeah, it's because like they got all new stuff, so it's all matching across company wide. So everything like either like was under contract mm-hmm. to stay with the with the space that one of the spaces that we we're renting, but the other stuff was like if anyone wants it, we're either we're gonna like throw it away, and all the monitors are being donated to schools. So if you want like mm-hmm. a chair or a desk, like you you sign up for it. And so I just went and picked that up today. So it was like a real bummer to drive to work on a Saturday, but at the same time there was like no traffic, so it was awesome. And then like I didn't know. I asked my dad, like, can I borrow your truck? He's like yeah sure and they had a lift gate on it and i didn't know that and it made my job so easy i was like push it over lift gate do i was like ah screw everyone else it was the best so now i have a fancy ass standing desk that i don't know what to do with but i might i might sell it because it's like they're expensive it's a motorized standing desk so so you're basically gonna flip it you're like i got this i mean that's all that's why i was like why wouldn't you take it you could at least sell it you know i mean i want to use it but if i can't find like a space for it i'm going to sell it for like if I put it up on Craigslist for a hundred bucks, it would be gone in like thirty minutes. Yeah. If people understand the value, at least. So that was that was something I did today, and then uh, I saw Annihilation, and um, uh, just like a bunch of stream stuff. I'm trying to upgrade the, my VR streams. So I've been experimenting with new tech and new stuff. Um, mm-hmm. So tomorrow I'm showing off. Uh, I'm going to be using trying to use a GoPro as a camera. And oh, I'm going to yeah. have a heart rate sensor for my like cardio stuff. So people on stream could see my heart rate <gasps> real time. I think it's going to be I, really cool. Speaking of heart rates, I also have another story. Does your, do you have like a palpitation? <laughs> oh, no, I do. I have a heart murmur, actually. <laughs> oh, OK. Wow. Exciting yeah, yeah, news. Yeah. <laughs> cool. <laughs> it's exciting news. I have a heart, a heart murmur, but it's like very, very like like minimal. That's why I could do sports when I was younger. But um, no, are you uh, not able to anymore? <laughs> No, <laughs> that's what he said. I, mean, I, I used to be able sports. to do sports when I was younger. It implies right. that you cannot anymore. That's true. But I used to be. I used to do sports. When I can't I was do like, it anymore, I, though. I can't. Can't do it anymore. I just break. Um, no, Take but one like step the last running, <laughs> die. Just <laughs> I'm um, dead. it wasn't worth it. Right. Um, last week at my elementary school, the so. I thought oh, wait, I have school. one more update. I have one more oh, update. Okay. Oh, good. Um, oh. I wrote a bot for Twitch called Meowbot, M Y A U. It's Meow and it's a it's phonetic spelling of Meow in Russian because like all the other variants were taken. And I'm like, oh, I'm Russian. Actually, it's kind of funny. Although I actually hate that spelling of it because like I, I like it, but like as as the function as, as the name of the bot, it was like naming things after that it was like, oh, I can't read any of this because it looks so weird. But the bot's name <laughs> is Meowbot, um, and it, it's a cat pun maker oh in chat in our in our twitch chat and it's open for anyone to use on twitch you just go to it and you there's a whole thing about it um i'm gonna put the instructions on on the meow bots twitch page so uh twitch.tv slash myau bot <laughs> and basically it will select like random messages if it has a word in it that can be like punified or, or, or I, what i call it is meowified um oh, it will goodness. like then say that message back in chat so like one of the funnier ones was like uh Oh shoot! I don't remember any of them. Let me. Oh, I think we tweeted one. Let me go, let me pull that up real fast. Uh, it was. 
bathroom at the motel feeding an old pizza. Now get back in that car, you hear me? Um, stupid thing. Oh, here it is, here it is. There it is. Um, CG's typing, CG might know something. Oh, so like one of the things is it replaces, I'm baby now, uh -oh. it replaces Twitter, uh -oh, we with, broke him. Uh, Twitter, Twitter with litter. So like, uh, we have a bot that like will tweet when we, it will put it in chat when we tweet. So it's like Twitter feed from, and then it was like litter feed from, and then we have another oh, bot that replaces things with butts, then it's litter butt, yep. and it was like pretty great. Um, so there's a bunch of stuff like that where it will, Cali is, Cali is Calico. Um, and like, we have a whole list and I'm going to add more words. So that's available. So that's why I did that. I, I finished that on, on Wednesday, um, and on my coding streams and I'm, I'm pretty happy about it. It's pretty cool. So she said, uh, so she said, and you have the butt spot as well and you get meow, butt. wait, yeah. Meow, butt punning off the butt spot. It's great. The whole system chat will soon be bots talking to each yeah, other. It's pretty like funny. It's going to be Skynet. Like that's what's yeah, going to happen. <laughs> Butt spot will replace random words with butt, and meow bot makes puns that are like can be like meowified. So then uh, meow bot will go, and then butt spot will trigger on that message, and then you have a catified pun with random words replaced with butt. And then, like, I'm like, our whole stream is just garbage. It's just like so someone will say one thing, and like three bots will fire off, and it's just like it's the worst, but it's also hilarious. So we tweet those, we tweet some of the better ones that we see. Um, it was all that. You were saying a thing about something. I forgot what you were talking about. Um. Oh my gosh, what was I talking about? Oh, oh. no, what did I do? Um. What you call it? Um. Last week when I was at the elementary school, the um, accountant Yoneda San wasn't there, and I was like, oh, like maybe he has the flu or something because it was going around. Because normally he's always there. And he's the only because he's the accountant, so he doesn't teach classes. So he's he sits right next to me. And we always like get to talk and like shoot the shit. So I was kind of like, oh, man, kind of like by myself today. And I was like, oh, hope he gets better from the flu. I and then like this past Friday, I go and he's there and he looked like he definitely went through something like I was like, wow, he really must have gotten like messed up by that flu because he looked very gaunt, like very just like pale and like he looked like he you could tell that he lost weight, like in not a good way. And it turns out, because he shows me, like, he wrote something in English. He's like, do you know how to read this? And I was like, oh, yeah, that's a really long word. It was, um, oh, God, I forgot the word. Uh, <laughs> the whole point of the story. Uh, <laughs> um, so anyways, it was really funny because it was a long word. <laughs> No, okay. So he holds up cardio respiratory. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. We're talking and about I'm heart like, rates. I couldn't even remember. Yeah. I still, you're telling the yeah, story. I rate. still couldn't remember what we were talking about. <laughs> and he holds that up, and I was like, "Hold damn!" Because he doesn't speak English, so like he has this word just ready for me, and I'm like, "Yeah, I mean, I can't give you what it means in Japanese, but I can because I don't know the word for it in Japanese." But I was yeah. like, "Cardio is you know heart rate, and then like respiratory breathing, and like circular, like you know that kind of stuff." He's like, mm -hmm. oh, "Okay, yeah, basically." And I was like, "Okay," and then he holds up. Um, uh, automated external defibrillator, and I'm like, "What the? Why? What are all these words?" <laughs> and I was like, "Hot damn!" And I was like, "Yeah, I mean, we just call it an AED for short." And he's like, "Oh yeah." So he's like, "Well," and he holds up cardio respiratory thing. He's like, "This happened to me," and then they had to use this and hold up the <laughs> AED word on me. And I'm like, "Excuse me." He's like, "Yeah, that's why I wasn't here last week. I apparently went because he d was running a marathon. He had a damn like heart attack." falls halfway through his marathon and then they have to like resuscitate him or whatever and i'm like you should be resting at home why are you here no one knows how it happened because he's like he runs marathons as a hobby yeah so it just happened one day in spring like not crazy like weather circumstances he just and like he showed me an article and it's just a picture of him like pass the fuck out like on the ground and like all these like ambulance like so, so like he passed him. out and he's like yo snap a selfie for me you guys like, basically <laughs> right is, it seems like that picture should exist no but, <laughs> that, i mean know, it was a news person, article oh, of okay, him. Okay, okay, like so. they took a picture of the other yeah, scene yeah. and i was like I, oh my like, god that's it, you the like implies i was, so there was shook. one person doing not nothing <laughs> oh no it was helping i guess i'll take photos right now no no newspaper um but yeah, and he was like, yeah, I'm still sore. And he had like burns where they used the um, the AED. Right. That's crazy. Yeah, I never think about that. Like those. Yeah. Like those things will like mess you up. I'm yeah. sure. Yeah. And he was still sore from where they, you know, did um, 
Oh man, why am I blanking? I can't. CPR? Or... Yeah, CPR. Oh, okay. Like his ribs were really sore and stuff. And I was like, I thought you had the flu. He's like, No, I almost died. And I'm like, okay. Yeah, yeah, that's worse. Good, you should good. be home. See you on Monday. <laughs> right? I was like, So, like, and I'm like, Well, thanks. And he told me this right before I left. So I was like, I hope to see you next week. Like, and then you're the one that's America. gone because you go to get a new job and he thinks right? you died. <laughs> That's why it sucks. I should tell that to my company. I should be like, look, you, you gotta let me say goodbye or else they're gonna think I ran a marathon and died. Like, You should on. on your last day and be like, my heart's weird. Well, anyway, see you guys next week and then you don't right? show up. It'll be the greatest prank. Dude. You should walk around complaining all day like, ah, oh, my chest hurts. Yeah, I'll be like, and oh, like three hours later, my chest really hurts. This is weird. That would be some so mean. <laughs> it would be the meanest thing ever. That would be so mean. Like, I wouldn't even... Like, and even thinking is making me they're feel, like, gone. bad. <laughs> right? No, oh, man, no. That's one of those, like, pranks where, like, no one's laughing. <laughs> yeah. So you do a prank show and everyone's like, that was just terrible. You're a terrible person. Right? It gets, it gets really, like, then someone, like, throws a funeral for you and then yeah. you just kind of have to go no, with it because oh, no. by this point you can't, like, say, just kidding. But then you go in disguise then to, like, and then you yeah. show up as, like, the person who's going to read a eulogy and you're like, my heart's really hurting. And then, you, no. then, you, then you're like, where did the guy go? And you're like, ha I got them again. Oh, my goodness. Right, uh, right before I give this eulogy, I'm going to, I got to go to the bathroom real fast. And then you, then you run off and everyone's just sitting there waiting. It's great. Yep. They're like, who was that person anyway? Keep they, pranking them. They were based. They looked like Julia, but just with a mustache on. It was very, it's very interesting. <laughs> Man, was I can't. Uh, I hate this because I can't remember the things I say if they're on stream or if they're on podcast. But <laughs> I think it was last week. Me and Tiffany had a really good joke going where it's like a guy with a mustache, and then he pulls off a mustache, and it reveals. Ah, oh, I can't remember the context of the joke. I hope it was on it the reveals podcast. Another mustache. It, it was like. Oh, hold on, I unplugged my headphones. Quick, talk all the shit, Jared won't know. All right, I'm back. Yeah, I, uh, so so yeah, the yeah. problem is I can't remember the context of it, and that's like half the joke. It was like some guy, in the, I think it was in the movie, he has a mustache on, and he's disguising himself to be like a 10-year-old, and it was like the, the, the improv was like, oh, he's a disguise, and then, I'm like, and then he pulls off his fake mustache, but he's a guy, he's trying to be like a 10-year-old. I don't know. It's, I guess it's not funny unless I hope it's on the podcast and but people remember you know it from last means? week and they're laughing at it and they're thinking it's great. That dude. just means that anyone listening, you need to listen in on the podcast all the time, and or you also need if, to watch the streams. Yeah, if it's that's if what it was it something means, on the stream, you know? then you need to watch the stream because I just remember that was like a good improv, but between me and Tiffany. Yeah, so y'all need to whenever that, you know, that make happened. sure you subscribe to everything and anything and get the updates and the notifications and. I, I, Get on that. That's one of those things where I don't wish. Don't really forget good. mugs brought to you by Up Down Lift Die. If we you invented don't them. wanna die, get get your mug. Remember, don't be stupid walking around with your hands holding liquids. Nobody wants to do that. Get a mug. This way you could put liquid in it and store it in there for a temporary and then you won't die from dehydration. This is true. Uh, oh no! Painting said that accent. Cringe. Excuse me. Excuse me. But Excuse me. Always, first, first you talk smack on the way I drink my coffee. <laughs> then you're talking smack on the way another part of me talks. Oh, okay. That's correct. It's fantastic. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, but that's like what the thing is like, I wish. So we try to outsource this to like our fans where they like get Twitch clips. Although we still haven't really done with anything with those. We have like thousands of them. Um, we'll do something with them someday. But I wish we were like a really big company that like, so then people would edit these down and like get the highlights, you know? So it was like mm -hmm. that improv bit, I could be like, oh, it's on YouTube now. Or like, it's really funny and mm -hmm. put it somewhere. Mm -hmm. It's just lost into the ether. Like it's all being, it's all recorded. We have all our streams recorded. We have like well over like a hundred videos on YouTube. Oh, but just yeah. like the information isn't being parsed by anyone. And that's where it's like, man, I wish we had like people who were like, doing this because like they have to edit this thing down because we need to make a social media post and then i'll be like oh go right yeah. then i can watch that because i my problem is i don't know where that is now unless it is in last week's podcast it's, yeah it's i just really all, don't know yeah. but i could listen to that whole podcast and be like wow i wasted an hour or two and it wasn't in there and i have to go turn through like streams i'll never find it and it's right. probably it probably wasn't that funny to be honest it was like the heat of the moment yeah the heat of the moment
Around. I thought I could convey it better to you, but then I realized how complex like the situation yeah. was for it to be like really funny. So I'm sorry. I'll just edit all that out. I'll just let me just edit back, edit out the last like 20 minutes because it wasn't good. <laughs> just play some elevator music. While you That's just great. Ding. Yes, I'll just mute us and I'll just let the mute movie newbie audio go. The oh, with, the, with the new Talladega Mirvi nights. Yeah, with the new setup, it's really great. I had a new audio setup, so like actually, um, wait a minute. Write that down. Talladega, Talladega, Talladega movie nights because nights as in like a movie night, but it's Talladega nights. Like knights. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. As in you really like my idea, Jared? Is no, that, like, oh, shoot. That, as oh. in like, it's awful. And I, it's bad. Oh, dang. OK, because I, I did realize after I said knights that Talladega nights is actually not like knights. It's just nights. So but that was a pun that you're making, I thought. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. That, hey, uh, that was guys, oh, was that not an, was that an <laughs> unintentional pun? Did you think it was Talladega Nights as in like they were nights? Yeah. So, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and say we're going to do Tal. La, I don't know how to spell it. Tal or Tal. Dagger, whatever. Tal. Oh, Targaryen. Talagarian. Talagarian. I'm doing it. Mo- movie. This is what great. are you doing? This is great. <laughs> Mo- I'm writing it down so we remember what we're going to call this this episode. Oh, right. We should be doing that. I swore I'd do, I'd do a better job <laughs> Tal- at that. Talagarian movie nights. Okay, sure. That makes no sense. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's just to, rem- to remind us. Um, I'm going to go grab my snack real quick. I'll be back in approximately 20 seconds. Okay. Wait, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> okay. Grabbing my snack. I have cookies now. That's my snack. Cookies and almond milk. I really feel like it's been more than 20 seconds. Hey, sorry. That might have been more than 20 seconds. I'm back. All right. So, so I got... Also, uh-huh. we had some technical issues and we all got snacks during that technical issue. <laughs> Dang it! I was gonna try to see if it was believable <laughs> that I didn't actually leave. So, <laughs> um, I <laughs> tweet at us. Let us know. Was it believable? <laughs> what did you think? <laughs> uh, <laughs> painting says, "Shake my head." I was like, "I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna just totally smash your illusion." Oh, oh why, yeah, why is the boy playing? <laughs> we were here for a reason. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> I thought, we're doing a real podcast where we just talk. Um, okay, <laughs> sorry if so your movie's I, out of sync because that's the only right, way to watch this movie. But we're actually not sorry because we're buffer buddies, so deal with it. Um, we were buffering. I, yeah, and we're buddying now, so it's what it is. We're beautiful rose buddies. Get it? Like a rosebud? Budding. Anyway. I warm I got a gift from one of my graduates yesterday, and it was a little chocolate lava volcano cake. Carla ate it wrong because she just thought it was like a piece of chocolate cake that she was supposed to eat right then and there. So she grabbed it, opened it and ate it. And the student got really sad because she's like, you're supposed to microwave it. So she turns to me and she's like, do not eat this now. Microwave it. Don't do it wrong. And I was like, ooh, shade. So um, I warmed it up right now. I like the idea that she like told she's like, oh. So like, Julie, don't you don't you, you if you didn't know you're supposed to microwave like if she's yeah. like I'm now the one that she knows. Kept, no, she kept she kept um like like saying twenty seconds, twenty seconds in the microwave. I'm like, okay, I got it. I the will problem with that though is it's it relative to how how many watts your microwave has. Well, that is it might true. Be, it's probably like fifteen in my microwave. I waited because actually mine started to explode, so I figured, hey, it's time to take it out now. Well, it is a lava volcano cake, so yeah, it, it probably should erupt. Er, yeah, it should erupt and like splatter your whole and, thing. Yeah, and so I I got it, and um, it actually it's very delicious. And I also picked up a little thing of ice cream, one of the seasonal Hagen Dazs, because I've, I've I've mentioned it before how I like to get the seasonal Hagen Dazs stuff. This yes, is delicious. Yes, many times you said that all, and you can't get you to shut I up have, about those. I have mentioned it. You don't even understand because they're perfect. Um, cause I'm not, I, I don't know how many of you guys out there know this, but I'm, I'm on the spectrum of lactose intolerance. So I, <laughs> lactose intolerance is a spectrum. Everyone should know that. I think, <laughs> I believe 
I want a shirt that says that because it is important to I'm me. I'm on the spectrum, I, and on the back of the shirt says, of lactose intolerance. <laughs> yeah, it was, I want that. <laughs> so everyone's um, like, I'm so, oh, what? <laughs> see, a, a painting says eat. me too, so there we go. It's important, people need to know this. But, I'm sorry um, to so all, I, my, all this noise from me opening these red velvet chips ahoy, you're coming to my mic, <laughs> trying to how do it away you? from the mic. <laughs> But um, so I love the small cups that ice cream comes in for Japan because it's Japan size and that's perfect for me. Because if there is a pint of ice cream in front of me, I will probably eat it. You're which like does small, medium, or large, or Japan? Uh, <laughs> right, Japan. Japan is always a little bit too much. I think I'll have a Japan, please. Yeah. Um, but it's perfect because this is really good and it's a. Um, I know, Jared, you don't like the red bean stuff, like red bean mochi oh, and things. The worst. But it's I do. Dessert. So for me, yeah. <laughs> Um, so this food. is red bean mochi ice cream, and it's delicious. So it's the little haagen So you have the um, ice cream underneath, and then you have um, bits of, like, thin mochi, like, throughout, like, spread throughout the ice cream, and then a thin layer on top, and then you've got the adzuki on top. And this is great. It's very good, and I'm pairing it with my chocolate lava volcano cake, and I am having a good Hold up to the camera. Hold snack. up the ice cream. Wait, hold on. Why can't I see you? Um, oh, there you go. Oh. Interesting. So is it like chewy then with the mochi? It's not too chewy. It actually kind of like melts in your mouth. But you know it's mochi. So it's not hard because if they put real mochi, like, it, yeah, it would have like hardened. Okay. But this is nice. The top two layers, they're not like, oh, oh look at this, look at this. I just feel like red mochi. bean doesn't like compliment it, it seems so like it doesn't make any sense to me i can't wrap my head around like but red bean being, i don't think it's that sweet it, to me it just tastes like might as well be refried beans like it's just oh. it's just beans to me wait really maybe i don't what know you've had is kind to, of like I, well, well my thing sketchy. my big thing is maybe it's sweet i don't know whatever it's the texture really is what ruins mm. like it for me how come I can't get rid of you now? Maybe. Like you're, you're just big. You're just, you're just looking at you eating ice cream. <laughs> Is it go, me again? Go Is away. Me again? I can't fix it. I'll never go away. Um, But I mean, this is red bean sauce. So I don't know if you can see it, but it's not the beans. It's yeah, just I mean, the sauce, I'm, actually. Maybe it's better than, I don't know. Yeah. It's just like my I friend say, had like come, mochi. I was like, can I have Japan. this one? He's like, it's red bean. I was like, no. Oh. Or like, I think I tried once. I was like, this is an awful everything. I'd say come to Japan. I'll show you how it's done right. And we'll have some fun. Okay. And then if not, it just means I get all the mochi. But <laughs> you won't be able to eat it. Yeah, I, I like the stupid, like... I'm, do you even do, like, ice cream mochi over there? Or is that, like, an American, like, us being stupid? That's definitely, an, like, a big American thing. Or it's not... We but probably it, have it here, but... Yeah, I was gonna say, it's gotta exist. It's a pretty... Like, it's not too crazy, but... I'm sure they don't, like... Have an entire yeah, dessert don't... shop focused on it like we do. No, and like I've never seen them at like a convenience store or the grocery store. It's probably like. But I saw them at um, Mitsua. Yeah, but that's also marketed for Westerners too. No, don't tell me that. I feel like I'm in Japan. You're (laughs) crushing the illusion. (laughs) (laughs) Sorry. The man is walking through those doors. I'm teleported into another land. How did I get here? Why is my watch say it's midnight? What's going on? Why is everyone on the wrong side of the aisle? Yeah, I'm pushing my cart here. Oh, I'm the rude American. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> and then I go buy beef tongue, the, the place that only sells beef tongue, and it's very expensive. I just like that there's a restaurant that only says, sells what? Beef tongue? I only have beef tongue when I'm doing Korean barbecue. Well, there's a place at Mitsua that like is only beef tongue. Hmm. But it's a ripoff. I mean, I don't know. Well, it's yeah, real expensive. I, yeah, it's like eight dollars or no, it's not even eight. I think it's more than that. I think it's like twelve dollars for like a lunch thing, and it's like a few pieces, and it's like mostly rice and other stuff. Okay, this thing keeps jumping to you, and I can't make it. Good. I didn't even. I'm not even on this computer. Like it's doing it on its own. How do I stop this? That's true. I'm um, sorry. Say so she's well. First, Tay oh. said I can't drink a glass of milk without my stomach feeling like I overate. Yes. So I got my almond milk right now. Well, that's just like um, carbs in general, I feel like. Like for you personally, do well, you I have, have celiac wait. disease? No, I mean, no, I, no, it's I could drink milk all day or whatever. Um, and I carbs and whatever. I just feel like when I eat carbs, I feel like bloated and like 
Yeah. That's what lacto- that's what lactose is is the sugar and milk. So I don't know. That's just me. I'm also just I'm also I'm on board with like milk alternatives like um uh like like almond milk or whatever just because it's like you don't need all those it's so much calories milk is almost like a one-to-one ratio to soda in calories well, milk is all whole fucking sugar too that's yeah. why though like that's the same, the you lactose, can't process yeah. the sugar because if you don't have that enzyme the yeah. mutation you mutated person okay. M- mutants it's evolution excuse mutants. me Ex- ex- um, evolution um but then sorry say said what about tacos when he's talking about beef tongue and yes you know i stand corrected what tacos oh, like the cookie okay. fell in the milk what about tacos i still don't understand beef, what the correlation of tacos tongue. yeah because you're talking about beef tongue and i'm like i've only ever had it all great champions all loved when it's um cream barbecue but is it in ground beef <clears throat> Well, what's not in ground beef? You know? Anything that's not beef. Am I right? <laughs> right? It's actually not beef. Oh, I can't. Sorry. This is chocolate lava volcano cake. This is a podcast where we don't talk because we're chewing on <laughs> sugar. Whoops. This is when it turns into the ASMR, you know, portion of the uh, eating, eating stuff and just ready. I'm going to drink my milk. <sighs> Out of your what? Out, what? What are you scooping that with your hands? Are you drinking it out yeah. of your hand? You know what? I, in case you guys didn't know, I am using a very suave, very nice up down left eye mug. That's right. You heard it. It's an up down left eye mug, and you can get yours at updownlefteye.com. That's fine. There's a shop. Yeah, that's fine. And there's, there's, a, there's a shop, shop link on there. It. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I don't want to give you a URL that's too long. You'll forget it. Just go ahead, updownlefteye.com. Get all the things there. While you're there, you can go watch some of their, you know, stuff that they've all done and shit. Do it! It holds your almond milk if you're on the spectrum of lactose intolerance, <laughs> that is. Oh, how much was the shipping? It was reasonable. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Jared, excuse you. Gassy boy. It wasn't me. <laughs> it wasn't me. Da, na, 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 na. It wasn't me. We use um we use um a uh, vendor. We use a vendor to uh, to get our, for our products. So they actually have um shipping out. Uh, they, they actually make the product in like wherever it's closest to you. I think they have like two or three locations. So like when Julia ordered it in Japan, it actually shipped from Europe. So it wasn't as expensive as shipping from America. So it wasn't like, I mean, it wasn't great priced for her, but it wasn't like- it could have been worse for sure. Yeah, it wasn't like more than the product cost. So I was actually pretty surprised with like, oh, it's it's all right. You know, it's like probably more than you want to spend for a mug total. But overall, like it was- But see, it didn't like- The best part- It wasn't like $50. It didn't like break the bank. The best part is I didn't just order a mug. That's right. You heard me. Yeah. There's more than mugs, y'all. I've I've got a total of like many stickers. I've got a hat. Yeah, that's right. I got an up, down, left eye hat. I've got a shirt, which I got because I was the first and the best VR guest. Were the you? first and the best VR guest. You might have been. The best. And that's why I got a free shirt because I fought them zombies. <laughs> Cause I'm well, really good you did. at it. You fell on the floor and the menu, so <laughs> hey, you didn't really do anything. If you guys want to watch those highlights, you can go ahead, go to updownlifteye.com, and there's a link for their YouTube vids and stuff. Cause I know how technology works. I'm not sure yep. if we have like a highlight of that, but I think there's a Twitch clip of it. So there's you go a on, Twitch clip of it. Yeah, 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 that's true. Twitch, and then go to clips. And then I don't know what you got to do to find that, but um. Right. Um, <laughs> painting said, "I feel like I fell asleep in front of the TV and woke up to paid programming." Yeah, this is like the fifth ad. I don't. Know, it's like we have to sell these mugs for some reason, but we don't. <laughs> like, it's not like we have like we're trying to liquidate. It's like like oh, the, the new business year is coming around. Are you talking about how you got some liquids and you'd like to put them in a mug? Do well, you have to get rid of your- liquids and need the place to put them? <laughs> A liquid, using it a liquid liquidate a liquidated liquid liquid are you are you gonna have a nice little dinner date where you and your significant other are gonna be drinking some liquids that's what i like to call a liquid date now go <laughs> that's a pretty good one <laughs> make sure you got some up down lift that much oh that's great i'm gonna ask someone if they want to go on a liquid date <laughs> 
It's like, and you just go to Jamba Juice. Wait, you guys, I was. Hey, what in Japan this? do they call it? Do they just call it like Jamba Ja? We is don't that, have a Jamba Juice here. Oh, well, did Sorry. you get one so we could figure out if they call it Jamba Ja? I would love they that. They would call it. They would probably call it Jamba. Nah, just they Jamba. Would. That's that's like I think that's is pretty this? good too, though. I, even yeah. though I hate Jamba Juice, it's all about juice it up. I think juice it up is better than Jamba Juice. Jamba Juice always tastes gritty to me. I don't know, but I, I would love I would love to be like, hey, want to go get some Jamba? Right. And then. I guess you can't, yeah, because juice it up doesn't work. You can't be like, can you want to go get some juice? Like, what's wrong with you? Apple juice? Do you go get, How old do you are you? Go get, right? 100% juicy juice in the box? Um, what if, what if you're just like, want to go to it up? What? Yeah. Let's go get some it up. Well, that's what I'm wondering because, like, again, like in Japanese, they, it's like one continuous kind of sound to them. I wonder right. how they would split it because they would they say juice or would they be like juice it? <laughs> like, I don't like it'd be great. It's great, great stuff. Japan is. Just is this is this the just one plop? Just one yeah, drop. I think it is. I think it is. <gasps> I don't know why, but I said that the other day and I couldn't remember where it was from. I thought it was from like some Harold and Kumar movie. You know what? That would be great if this movie was Harold and Kumar instead somehow. A single plop. I think I've only seen <laughs> The White Castle from Harold and Kumar. We should put some of those. Mo Are those movies good? Hey, we should put some of those. Yeah, should they be on the list? Why not? White Castle should be on the list. Why haven't we done any of those like, you know, the not another teenage movie? Yeah, but, like, the, we have. Yeah, like know? those stupid like what is that like yeah. early two thousands like really just kind of like bad movies that were made for like I guess teens or something weird. Uh, who, who, who was the target audience of like Harold and Kumar and yeah, not another teen movie and like those it's just like young adults Probably like twenty twenties like. Kids the in their stoner college, kids who college. are going to community college. <laughs> I don't know. Real, real maybe. You know what movie I really like that like I had watched all throughout high school like multiple times and then like only I, I revisited it revisited it, it recently and really just like was able to connect to it more. Accepted with Justin Long. I haven't watched that yet. It's been on my list to watch for like six years. <laughs> It's it, I so it's way up there on one of my faves. I heard it's, it's really, really good. good. I just don't know why I haven't watched it. Working with some dangerous herbs. <laughs> Powerful, not dangerous. Damn it. Glenn's wads. Um, we need to watch cats and dogs, and everyone has to bring a cat. It's not dumb. It's just dumb. Why is it dumb? That's a problem for some people. <laughs> it is a problem for some people. Um, I would love to bring a cat, but then that means I would have to steal someone's cat no is there cats like wa walk around in japan yeah i just saw in my area because i live near a very big street um oh, but well, i that, imp that implies very sad things yeah <laughs> um yeah. i just imagine it's like that that video of the cameraman with the kitten all the time just you're just walking you're like oh i made a friend today like that's how i imagine Aww. it because that because that one video in the city, there's probably like a lot more like strays and stuff. There is. Oh, I don't remember what country it is in. Somewhere in Europe, I think. And they're like, every the cats are part of like the history of the city, and in all the cat, all the cats are everyone's cats, and people just leave like food out, and everyone take everyone pitches. No one like owns the cats. Like everyone they're, takes care of. Everyone the cats. takes care of, care of all the cats, and there's so many cats, and I'm like, I've got to move there because they're just like, they're not really strays. They're just like cats that, like, they, and they like some people like build like there was like even someone who built like a cat hotel for them. So there's a big Ooh, box nice. where, so where all the cats that's are like, cool. so they have somewhere to go. Yeah, it was like, yeah, because that's what kind of like if I moved out, I'd be like, I don't know if I actually want a cat because of the amount of work to like and I cost I would love for mm. a cat that like is just wanders around though that comes visits me and like you know comes and goes as they please I think that would be yeah. really cool and if it decided to like live there then sure whatever but I would love like this fluid cat and I'm like maybe it's a neighbor's cat maybe it's no one's cat I don't know if it comes over cool and I'm like but like how you can't control that and you're like maybe you have a cat that's nearby maybe you don't but in that city there's that you have a ton of them there's just cats all over it. it'd be like the coolest thing I would mm -hmm. I'd want that and then you don't really have the full responsibility of like, you have to take care of this cat or it's going to die. And it's like, well, it costs yeah. me money. Or you the could all pitch in. The only thing I would say, though, the only thing I would say is if you were to do that, though, at least like the only thing that you're going to put like a good amount of money down on is to either spay or neuter the cat. Don't feed and give like a, an outdoor cat or a stray cat all this like food and attention if you're 
if you're not going to spare or neuter oh, it. That's a good point. Yeah, if like, you're not willing it. to then take care of the kittens and then get homes for those, that's because that's what a lot of people do because they're like, oh, I don't want the responsibility of actually having to take care of like the vet yeah, bills and stuff. Yeah. And then, but then like, you're not that... helping the stray cat problem. That's so, a good point. like, if you, you know. But that's the thing. I want the stray cat problem so I could have a bunch of cats come visit me. <laughs> that's but then a... look at how many cats get killed. Yeah. Like, nice, you know? It's unfortunate. But yeah, that's yeah. a good point. Because, I mean, that's not too much to do, right? Isn't it like 100 bucks? Mm, it's not that bad. When they're younger, it depends on weight, too. I looked and at... It's, um, it's more expensive for female just because it's more of an... It, they have to go yeah, internal. Yeah. Females, it's a lot um, I looked at, easier. Because, like, we have to take... I guess my mom... My, we, have to, we take our cat to the vet now, like, I, like once a week or something like that to get, like, this shot because they have, like, arthritis. And then they're always, like, super happy after that. It's pretty great. But, um... So they're probably getting, like, a, a steroid or they're getting no, a histamine. No, it's, shot. um... It's actually, like, a shot for, like, something else, but it also treats... Like, it happens to, like, help with... I forget exactly what it is. Um... It's not, it's yes, not like, just be careful because that could also affect if they're older that can affect their liver and their kidneys yeah I think they, the, the vet they did blood work before they started this I think um, but just it's because just like, that, that usually really really fucks up um, the kidneys of cats because cats kidneys are very sensitive yeah, just already yeah. because of what they have like are supposed to be eating yeah but I was looking at cat I was looking at insurance for them and it's like so mm, expensive because they're old but then I looked at it for kittens and it's like $30 a month I'm like oh it's so cheap like why wouldn't you and now it's like yeah I'm not going to spend like $200 a month on cat insurance <laughs> but yeah. it's like that's probably a pretty good idea if we started that earlier probably would actually save money from that so look into cat and pet insurance you guys I can't remember what this one was it was re it was re it was a uh, it was recommended by Nala Cat on Instagram the most famous cat on Instagram and yeah it it's up. just a I'm very also very nervous about because like with insurance, it's cool because I looked that up when I got Flapjack. But like when you have an animal that's insured while like the costs are lower, like and they help out, like when you take the cat to the or the cat or dog to the vet, you're required to constantly, constantly, constantly like update like the rabies and vaccinations and things oh, like yeah. that. It's not necessary. But and that's what I'm saying with kidneys, because it's basically like imagine like any kind of shot that a human gets the same strength is what's given to dogs and cats. Yeah, I think I heard size. about that. And it was like, what and are they doing? Like, why are they that, like it's going to be that stuff, dosage. Yeah. And like, that's why. And also with like food, again, this goes back like I can get on like my pedestal and talk because or my soapbox don't, and talk because I've worked I know I, yeah so I'm saying like I won't but just because being in like you know like the pet, pet food industry and stuff like that but um uh yeah if you license your dogs or cats like you have to obviously get that all updated but like based off of like the levels and stuff it really does hurt their kidneys quite a bit um so it's kind of like a trade off you know it's like, yeah, but yeah. if you have the insurance and you can afford to take care of the kidney, you know, so it's like, well, but <clears throat> I'm sad that my dessert's all gone. I ate it all, you guys. What am I going to do now? You shouldn't have ate them together and you could have spaced them out and then you could have had more dessert by spacing but it was it like perfect like taking a, a little bite of the chocolate lava volcano cake and then like taking ice cream and then taking well, what a bite. is like, it I quantity love versus that. quantity Qu quantity say, versus quantity did I just the same word? <laughs> <laughs> wait no okay i'm gonna put that as a possible quantity versus, versus qu i think the other one's better because it's funnier SEO is versus it, SEO. <laughs> oh man, quantity versus qu I wow. This is how I typed it. Oh, this is how I so typed it. So they are guys. different words then. <laughs> typed out, they sound the same. They're homophones. <laughs> they sound the same, but they're spelled there differently. <laughs> yep. Quantity versus quantisentry. <laughs> qu Quesentry. I feel like that's what I, that's kind of like when you're questioning whether or not it's the turn the, of the century. Yeah, like, what century am I in? You're like, you know, it was kind of one of those things where everyone was like, oh my god, let's celebrate like 2000, but actually they should have been celebrating 1999. Or was it 2001? Which one is it? What? Wait, when it's turning 2000, you're celebrating the past year? No, 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 because like, 
wasn't there like this big thing where people said like because everyone was like we're celebrating yeah. the, like the arrival of a new century but it actually was they were either a year early or a year late oh were they because of how years were actually like when you're supposed to count like okay, so the year yeah well, the 19 okay i so. swear that was a thing oh i think i kind of know what you're talking about yeah you know like people were it, celebrating on like january or december 31st of 1999 for but, 2000 but it wasn't supposed to be that it was supposed either you're like, supposed to celebrate 2001 or you're supposed to celebrate i'm pretty it sure it might have been like the end of the no yeah what oh i have what is it what it's something there's something up. i swear because it's kind of like when your birthday comes around so like let's say you're turning like 30 um mm -hmm. you're like you're not actually like 30 yet you're building up to the, the your 30 yeah you're not you you have yeah. just finished your 29th year you're not like you ha you are something like yeah, that's kind of yeah, this yeah. is kind of like that like yeah well it hasn't been the year yet or i don't know maybe that didn't make yeah. any sense edit this part of the podcast yeah, out too i don't know <laughs> that's but that's basically see that when the fact that we are questioning that that's what that word is that i made up uh, yes q u e s n t u r y or it's also in any any time travel movie where they're like what century is it you could always go exactly. you know the quant question century scene yeah it's that part's my favorite every time you could be like that so it's, i love it's, it it's you in know, like three movies quenstry quenstry <laughs> the quenstry scene is like the best yep. I always love that because always nope, like what's the, what's the year and it's like it's always so funny. It is. It's so great. It's like well, here's the newspaper. You're like whoa! I went back and I went whatever. back. It's the same century though. Good job. Okay, good. Oh, I just got a message uh, okay. from one of my girls that just uh, graduated because now I'm allowed to like know them outside of school because they're graduated. Whoa. Yeah, um, but she she sent me a message in English and it made me really happy. So she said, I'll be back. But again. I can't read it. I don't understand. That. It doesn't make any sense to me. So <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, I've, I've had years of practice. Um, I'll be back again at that time. I'll give you homemade sweets. I'll try my best. But aren't you going to be gone? Oh, no. <laughs> She'll knock on your door no. and then. And there would be a funny smell coming from it, and then you, the, and then she'd be like, "But she was complaining about her heart the, the yesterday." <laughs> no, we come full circle. We've come full hard attack. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, You're gonna no. leave some trash that will smell in a few weeks to really just think like that, so that prank goes really far. So when someone's like, I, "Oh no, did she die?" and they start investigating, it's like you're just keep you got to keep it going. You got to keep it going. Yeah, I got to keep it going. Yes. This is a mean prank podcast. We talk about mean pranks. The mean prank podcast. You know what? The mean prank is podcast. Say that five times fast. Mean, mean prank, prank podcast. podcast. Mean yeah. prank podcast. The, mean the mean greatest mean thing though is because we're gonna get to like 200 episodes, and I'm gonna be like, just a prank. What? I never recorded any of these. Deleted them all. Yeah, no one wow. actually. They didn't go anywhere. Right. I put them on a little website, and then they were masked, so only your guys' IPs could see them. You guys thought it was a thing, but it wasn't. It was never. It never made it out to the public. Right. Wasted all your time. Waste your time. Two thousand. Right. Two, the two thousand century. Waste your time. <laughs> what? Quite, quite you remember that when people used to say um, that, like 2008? I think people used to say that. Waste your time, 2008. Oh, I thought it was don't hate 2008. Oh, maybe it was. It probably wasn't 2008, but it was a thing. People used to say it. I'm bringing it back. Anyways, Bring what's up? Bring it back, up? man. I Bring think it you're back. Say something? I, was, I was gonna say something. Oh yeah, I was gonna say. Speaking of mean prank podcast, you're much podcast. better at remembering the things that you're gonna say than I was. I am. So there we go. Hey, I, one for me. Um, I immediately forget. <laughs> if I get interrupted, it's gone. I don't remember it. What? Is, what was that? I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> Moving on. Um, um, I forgot what yes, you were gonna say again. <laughs> I, okay. Speaking of mean prank podcasts, <laughs> I have orientation for my new job on like March 27th, but I think I start training on. Um, April 1st, but what if I like go there and they're like, April Fools, you're not hired. And then. <laughs> and you sign a lease. Life. Joke's on you. Goodbye. Joke's on you. Because the company is going to help me with, uh, they give me a living allowance. So they actually help oh. me with part of my, um, what they're supposed to, but I'm now worried that it's going to be like April Fools, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, because, oh, wait, because you're starting in April? Was that the um, joke? Was that the intro? To, was that a part of the story I missed? Yeah, I said because I'll have training on April 1st. Oh, yeah, yeah. And so okay, the yeah, prank yeah, is that they'll say April Fools because it's April Fools. Do day. they have April Fools in Japan? They do not, but I oh. should make it a thing. Yes. <laughs> I should go in and before they could, you know, 
do the joke, I'll be like, April Fools, I, I actually quit. didn't sign it. Yeah, I quit, you know? I'm teach, kidding, please. Teach yourself, please don't. student. Please don't. <laughs> and you throw the yeah, papers. Dumb. I always want dumb, th- I always want people to do that. It's like the thing in the movies throw that people papers. never do. Just like, what's up? And then just like, like just so like, F you. And then like throw the cat. Oh, I want that so bad. Just once in my life, I want to see someone. I quit papers. We don't even have papers here. We're software engineers. Where'd you get that? <laughs> what? What is this? <laughs> What is what? No, that's what I'm saying. Oh. Like, I'll be like, what, what is this? I was this? just thinking you're like looking down at your phone and I'm like, are you responding to me or the thing on Twitter or something? <laughs> uh, mean, mean prank podcast, you may never know. I don't know what you're, yeah, you're pranking me. What? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Oh. We have not spoke about the movie like once this time, the whole podcast. Um, well, like, shit's going we're, down. It's just in the us movie. talking over like car noises. The car noises of the podcast. I mean, that's a nice car it's actually noise. Actually, because I've had my window open this whole time and yeah. you can hear the cars. We couldn't get a copy of the movie, so we just let yeah, the car so noises come through. Yeah, we just had to make our own soundtrack. Tiffany, yeah. <laughs> Tiffany's, Julia's window. Wow. I called my cat uh, Tiffany. Mean, mean prank podcast, you guys. I've been Tiffany this whole time. Wow. Ah, uh, wow. Um, wow, wow. Uh, I called my cat Tiffany today. It was very funny. <laughs> Wait, which one? I think it'll Trinity. Ah, uh, if you, if you, if <laughs> <laughs> the fat white one. You... <laughs> was that your joke? <laughs> no, I was gonna say if you called like Neo is the white one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, he's black and white. Because I was gonna say like if you um. No, because didn't you put pictures uh, on your Insta story? Mm-hmm. You, you were hanging out with Neo, so I just mm-hmm. thought like if you were like playing with him and then called him Tiffany. Why would no? why that make <laughs> way less sense? I called Trinity <laughs> Tiffany because both the names start with T. Oh, okay, that makes sense. T- t- but t- Tiffany's the chosen one. Is she? <laughs> she is. Is Since she not? What? For what? You so, didn't know. Chosen by. I can't think of a joke. Chose <laughs> me neither. I'm like, what's funny? Different. I don't no, know. No, that's why she's the chosen one because she can always make a joke, a joke about everything. Like the chosen how my pun. Life sometimes she's feel. a chosen. She's pun. the chosen pun. There you go. I got it. Nailed it. I made Speaking a pun of joke. Chosen puns. Zakulia is in rabbit. But not. In this. He did this last week, so he he joined and left. So I don't know. Uh, maybe because you. We're here and I wasn't. And he was like, fuck this shit out. Well, no, out. no because like, he, he can't be here when you're here because he's supposed to be you when you're not here. I mean, we haven't heard you, a word yet. Do we, from how come we haven't seen you guys both in the same room at the same time? Do we exist <laughs> together on the same plane? I don't know. Well, I mean, like, I don't know, maybe if you're both flying back from Japan or something like that, you would exist on the same plane. But remember, Zakulia doesn't like planes because of tentacles coming out of the ocean. What? I was on burp again. Sorry. Was I here for that? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking I about. I think this chocolate cake had some cocaine in it. I don't know what's happening, guys. Are you getting oh, high man. off Coke? I'm getting high off Mountain Dew. <laughs> oh, <laughs> not what they say, though. I'm so mad. You're really like saying I'm that all the up. time. Wait, in I'm your in your classes, up. were you all no, the time you know, like, oh, I'm high in Cup Mountain Dew? You're like, everyone's like, everyone's right? like, doesn't get you're like, it's a joke in America. It's so funny. And then but it I finally came they're... around that you said it enough. They got it. They're all laughing at it, and you're gonna be like, class, I have something to say. I'm a fraud this whole time. It's not the right. It's not the right words. It's I'm getting jacked on Mountain Dew, and they're like, what? And you're gonna start all the way over and explain the American joke to them. Right, but see, like, I think the reason why I don't want to say it is because I say I'm high off of Mountain Dew, right? Like, but if I, I would probably accidentally say I'm, because it's supposed to be I'm jacked up, or I'm jacked, what, what's the, because I would accidentally say I'm jacked off of, I don't want to say that. It's what? bad news. <laughs> Wait, what? I don't know. What? <laughs> you, you, you're saying I'm jacked uh, wait, what is it? Jacked on? Jacked up? Jacked up? <laughs> up, down, jacked on? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Why is there an ad in this movie? <laughs> <coughs> what was happening?
happening to the world? <laughs> I really like my new uptown. <laughs> These podcasts always fall apart at the end. It's probably the best thing about them. Wait, it's what is like, this? It's like, a, it's like a car crash in slow motion. Wait, that, did big you wink, know? Wink if you're watching the movie in sync with the, with the podcast. Wink in sync. Our new segment, sync. you guys. Wink in sync. All right. How do, what does that entail? We all just wink and uh, sync for week, a few ne- seconds. <laughs> next week, everyone quiet. Uh, wink and sync special guest will be um, late, or J- Lance Bass from In Sync. So we'll be winking in sync with In Sync. Wow, that's amazing. How do <laughs> how do we get him? <laughs> I'll try to tell you many times. Hey, Pat Benatar, good. you guys for the. This part's such an emotional moment of the movie for me. I think we should take a moment. Because <laughs> you watch. can't do sports anymore because of your heart? I can't, I can't do <laughs> sports like, anymore. I wish I could heart. run. I wish I could run to Pat Benatar. <laughs> Wait, why does his his jumpsuit say me on it? Is there is that a joke? Wait. Me? Yeah, it just says me. Oh, he's the sponsor. Oh, that's pretty Maybe? funny then. That's actually really you funny. I've never noticed that before. I don't know. I feel like that might that that's probably the joke because I think like he like funded his own car or whatever. Like, he has no other mm-hmm. like patches or what are those? Why would you jump on onto car on concrete? He just broke his knee. Did you see that his knee hit first? Oh! Ouch, 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 ouch. Uh, oh wait. Um, does that count though? You have to cross the, the finish line, don't you? Oh, my students say or said that she she's like, do you like chocolate? I will make brownies. Yes, please. Pot brownies. Tell her that. Tell her that. No. (laughs) She's like, I want to get over to this party. No. She's like, I'm jacked up off of Mountain Dew or whatever it is. (laughs) It's jacked up. I'm pretty sure that's the the thing. But jacked up. And then what do you say? Jacked up on Mountain Dew? I'm jacked jacked up up on Mountain Dew. See, I don't like the prepositions. I don't like all the prepositions. I'm jacked. Ja- oh. I'm I'm high off Mountain Dew. It just to me, That's, it's easier to say than I'm jacked thing. up off Mountain Dew. No, but it's not. I'm high off of up on Mountain Dew. Oh, I'm jacked yeah. up on Mountain Dew. I'm high off. Oh yeah, you have the extra. And then on. that's why I accidentally put I'm jacked off <laughs> on Mountain Dew, and I'm like, wait, no. <laughs> oh no, we lost Zach. Oh, he's back. Oh, he's back. Zach attack. <gasps> Zach attack. Oh, bra- Okay, Rabbit, like, uh, for some reason, Rabbit hates this one computer I'm on, and it, like, constantly, like, crashes. So there's also a spot in the podcast where the movie audio stops, because I had to re- refresh the page. Oh, no. I don't know why this computer hates it so much. It does crash. <laughs> Zach said I'm lit AF off Mountain Dew. I think that works. That's that's the, well, that's if this that's movie what... was made today. That's what we would get. Yeah. I'm lit AF off. Oh wait, no. I'm lit ass. I'm lit. You know, such an old, how old are you? I am. I am light AF. Am I saying I'm it right, light kids? Light AF Mountain Dew vape. <laughs> oh wait. <laughs> vape. Man, imagine a Mountain Dew vape. Imagined it. I imagined it. Vape light. <laughs> I'm going to say that now, though. I'm going to be like walking around and be like, yeah, I really love that movie. Vape. Yes. Hey, this, <laughs> this steak is so good. Vape. 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 <laughs> what are you even saying? I don't know. I just thought Vape. it would be. I'm just trying to fit in. <laughs> vape. You my vape. What? I don't know. It's a thing. Just go with it. Vape me, vape no. me. <laughs> hey man, that, the real song is worse. I know. <laughs> like, this is an improvement. They vape after every time they take a fat, fat pH rip. Fat. Would you? Cause like, what if? What if you had to do that? Like, what if you had to? Like every time you like partook in um like vaping or like drugs or alcohol like you have to You're say like, the name of what you're weed. doing <laughs> yeah but like but specific you'd be like joint or blunt <laughs> oh, and then I, like, very, very specific 
Right, very specific. Pop brownie. And so you just have to be like, vape. <laughs> like you, you, just, you have to like eat the pop. You're like, pop, pop, pop brownie. You're like, wow, your mouth is all full. Right? You're like, pop brownie. Right? I can't. I can't you, I'm as you're very sniffing, hard time you're like, simulating a person chewing Taco and Bell. talking. <laughs> Taco Bell. Right? Do you have to like yell it out though? I like the idea that you like take a bite, you're like, of, Taco yeah. Bell, and then you're like, "Gosh, I hate to eat Taco Bell." Maybe that's the way. Like, screw the stuff that Black Mirror has about technology. Maybe what it's actually going to go down is like any type of thing illegal. You have to yell it out loud, <laughs> and so illegal. people in the area will be like, "Oh!" So all of a sudden, you're you're like. You're, you're just like pickpocketing. God damn it! No, I'm really bad and at like, this. African American mirror. American. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> instead of black mirror, I'm yes. sorry. <laughs> I need to be a little bit more PC with my words. I apologize. Oh my goodness! But um, it the the yelling out after you say things illegally reminds me of like something I do, but not because of illegal things. Remember, I left that behind when I used to be in high school. You guys, I no longer steal <laughs> answers to tests because I'm the one that makes the tests now. So do you, do you still sell them though for snacks? <laughs> like, pss, hey, oh, shit. Pss, hey Jimmy, oh, shit. if you get me some snacks, I'll give you the answers. Teacher, you can't do this. Shut up. <laughs> What are you gonna do? You're gonna tell on me? <laughs> You're the school what? bully. I am the authority, right? <laughs> I am. Um, Have you been being bullied? Mm, you could tell me. No. <laughs> I'll fail you, <laughs> Jimmy. Fail you. I love how I. There's there's a per, there's a student named Jimmy at my all girls Japanese high school. <laughs> it's great. Um, I was gonna say though, like for some reason, if I hiccup after I hiccup, I say hiccup. Okay. I let I let people know that I just hiccup. I, well, it only happens when I hiccup. <laughs> like I'll you can't like, control it. And so we... <laughs> no, I don't know. And like Carla's always like, "What are you letting me know that you just hiccuped?" I'm like, "Yeah, I, I, you know." And I think it's because you know I don't do it for sneezes. I don't do it if I cough. But I bet you it's because hiccups you know i i have a feeling that the reason why hiccups just happen you know and you can't get rid of them is because they're kind of like alerting you and saying like hey i'm here i exist so if you right off the bat go hiccup you are addressing the concern and then they go away i did that try one. So, try it next time you hiccup okay, say, I'll, I'll try it hiccup, and they'll hiccup, go away I, I acknowledge your existence but yeah. i'm not good i in high school once i i did what uh, zach zach Kulia says in chat he's like i do it for sneezes i say ah sneeze i did that once in high school because i'm a pretty loud I'm, I mean, this is a weird thing people sneeze at different volumes i sneeze pretty loud i'm like but so then one time i was like i actually did i just like Sneeze and went, sneeze! And then everyone laughed. It was pretty great because it was like out of the blue. It was the one time I did like something like funny and like obnoxious in a class. And that was one of my things. Hi, I'm his lady. I'm Susan. Does that, does the, Zaculia says, does the same work for bills? If the gas company comes and I yell bills? <laughs> Do they? Maybe. Leave. Oh, you say, if you acknowledge oh, them. Do they question? Right? They'll be like, all right, paid, done, cool, we're out, we got this. Oh, you guys, I don't want to go to work tomorrow. Oh. My incomplete question sounded like Hamlet. What? I don't know. Did you say Hamlet? Where Oops. art thou? For you thou, oh. where are you? Tell the Dega Knights, are you thou thus that? How come? How wow? How now? How you like been? How how now? For thou thou driving thy car, V oh, six no, cylinders. How him. many are you? Jump over the moon, say he said. Hamilton, the end. <laughs> Hamilton, the end. Oh, I love I love a, the, uh, a, the outtakes at the end. Behind the scenes, this? you guys. Oh, these are good. Behind the scenes, that's, that's, that's an ongoing bit on our po on our not a podcast, our, our Twitch stream. Oh no, cat blindness! <laughs> I love these. I hope the podcasters can hear it. Oh, probably not. I probably, I probably turned down the volume too much. Oh shoot, we gotta um, we gotta do a. Uh, 
ratings and oh no you gotta do housekeeping then we do ratings yeah. and then we'll do something we Julia's have some kind of format that we loosely yeah. follow john c yeah. riley's unfortunately super rude irl is that his friend not is that not a will ferrell will ferrell yeah is john it's c riley not, not real ferrell that's my question correct john okay. c riley is not will ferrell if you know who by default know that john c riley is the other one Feral, Phil Whirl. Phil Whirl, dang it. Um, all right, housekeeping? <laughs> oh, um, I, are we're not, okay, whatever. Um, let me turn Sorry, out. it's because I realized, like, we might, like, end up watching these. We are no watching these. Well, I, I, know, oh, I like, agree, no I agree. It's pretty, yeah, it's pretty, yeah. Well, they could hear, but it's probably, you're right, it's probably too quiet, and it's probably like, why are they just not talking? Um, right. so, uh. I always, I never even know what to say to the housekeeping anymore. Find us on BufferBuddies.com. That's probably the number one place to go. Um, like, I, I always, the reason I say that is also because, like, if this ever changes and we add stuff and remove it, I don't want to give you guys information that becomes stale. Because once it was a podcast, I was like, tweet at us. And I was tweeting at them. And then, like, episode, like, 30, they're like, we don't use Twitter anymore. It's like, what? I was doing it the whole time. So BufferBuddies.com is always going to be the place to go for any information, new and past. And we'll always try to keep that up to date with, like, links and all that stuff that you need but you could go to bufferbuddies.com we have our link to our discord if you want to listen in just like all the people here um that um are here listening we have uh, also thank you guys for listening uh we have painting all night sechiami z panda dimba and um someone else <laughs> me <laughs> what what did you say and me someone else and someone, someone else. else is just yeah, secretly else. listening in they are secretly listening in um uh, and so, like, we, you, you come and listen via that, uh, or you could go tweet at us, hashtag Buffer Buddies, hashtag BBEP43. That way you could find any other tweets that ha or has shared, like, quotes or whatever that you enjoy. Or I, earlier on in the podcast, I said something about tweeting at us about something. I don't remember. I forget everything. But whatever it was, if you tweet at us, just make sure use hashtag Buffer Buddies and hashtag BBEP43. Um, and that way we, we could find it. And I'll get the little notification on my phone, and then I'll go like, retweet, um, and all that stuff. And uh, oh, our Reddit page is on, on the website as well, where you could go and vote for what movies you guys want us to do. Um, we loosely mm -hmm. follow that, unless we, for some reason, just go up around that and do 22 Jump Street, which I think is next week's movie, if Tiffany's back. So there we go, just ignoring everything. Uh, if she's I think back, yeah. Also, get your mugs for some reason. You really need to buy <laughs> one of these mugs. We have no get reason to pressure mugs. you. There's no reason to pressure you to buy these mugs besides that it helps us out, but go buy one for some reason. Get also, your mugs. We also have a like, bunch go of... get them, but don't tickle me. <laughs> you can you get do your it. Um, we also have a bunch of shirts and stuff. Like, we have, like, crop tops for women and just... Crop top, crop top. And normal shirts That's for guys <laughs> and just normal things. So um, also, I'm waiting on the... Well, the, I mean, guys... Guys, don't worry. If you want to wear a crop top, you, you are could. more than welcome. You, you could. Do it. Yeah. Show on... your midriff. Go to the gym. Be like, I'm working abs today. You can see them because I'm wearing my up, down, left, side like, crop top. Like, go do it. All right. You also have to be like New Jersey or whatever when you wear it for some reason. Is it New like, Jersey? No, you don't have to have like a New Jersey. You, you want to put it on it. and you become New Jersey. The state. Oh, I thought you were saying like you're gonna get like a new sports jersey and like wear it to the gym, but don't do that. Instead, just wear it. no. Okay. <laughs> pretty, good. pretty good, actually. Um, uh, Tiffany's gonna hate this so oh, much. Oh yeah, she's it's the worst. Like, she's, just, she's like, I'm the chosen I pun. Am. Stop taking. She's the chosen pun. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, gonna change her Twitter name. I'm gonna be so happy. Um, <laughs> What was I saying? Oh, yeah. So we have, a, we have a bunch of stuff on there. I'm waiting for our printer. I don't know why I'm telling you guys this because it's more up to outside than the Buffer Buddies. But I'm waiting for our printer to add some new technology so we could get some jackets. And they're going to be the best jackets. I'm going to start getting. I'm probably going to order jackets for when we get them. I'm going to get. I'm probably going to get me and Tiffany jacket. And maybe I'm probably going to get jackets for like some of our mods on Twitch. And so just they're so close. They started teasing the beta for the technology of like uh, some of the stuff or like the printing that I need. And they're like, mm -hmm. we're, we're going to do doing it soon i'm like yes yeah, i've been waiting for so long so super excited about that adding that to our store it's gonna be very i think very awesome um i think that's all i have to say about that stuff it's pretty okay. pretty same same old same old same um, old same old all right um 
Oh, then should we move on to ratings? Oh, oh, or? Also, I don't know. We're on Spotify, if anyone cares. Oh, Spotify. I, mean, I was telling Tiffany, I, I think because you don't know that because I think it was on the last episode, but I was telling Tiffany, it was kind of, I always thought, I, I realized like, I was like, again, like walking to work, I'm like, how can we tell people where they could find the podcast? I assume if they're listening, they've already found it on, on yeah. the platform that they want to listen on. It's right? not like someone went out of their way and was like, I really wish this was on Spotify. Oh, thanks for telling me. It's like, whatever they're right? listening on is probably the one that they want to listen to. So I was like, we probably don't yeah. need to tell them that. <laughs> but anyways, that was, I always, I just thought that was a funny thing. Uh, yeah. Ratings? Oh, is that what we're doing? Do we do ratings? Yeah. Do we do Julie's Junk first? Please. Yeah, we'll do ratings and then Julie's okay. Junk. It's rating. Um, yes. I so... looked at the movie probably three times, so I'm going to say <laughs> 10 out of 10. Um, oh, I don't want to steal your rating, though. I'll let you go first because I, I have backups. Okay, so I'll read what Seichi said. Seichi says 8 out of 10 car pileups. Um, painting said 9 out of 10 Julie presented up, down, left, eye commercial. <laughs> <That's> pretty good. <laughs> Minus 10 out of 10 kids who are half Mountain we, Dew. We, we almost had 10 commercials in this episode too, so that's pretty close. <laughs> probably We probably got 9 out of 10 of them, so we probably need we to probably throw in a few did. more. We probably did, there you go. Yeah. Yours, was, yours was high off Mountain Dew? Yeah. The not, the, not the 10 out of 10 one. kids. Because I wrote 10, 10 out of 10 kids because I'm trying to keep it so it's accountable. And then I, I was going to write kids who are. And then I was like, but I can't put jacked off and then kids in the same sentence. So I'm going <laughs> to keep it high off of Mountain Dew. <laughs> pretty, yeah, yeah, that's a pretty smart move. Yeah, I don't, don't know if I'm... flagged by the FBI or whatever. <laughs> right? Uh, not, we don't want that kind of SEO. <laughs> we don't. We don't. I mean, we're fine with having our sticker... <laughs> Or on a missile the, the, from North the Korea, Kim, Kim you know? Jong Un missiles. I'll, yeah, because at least that's, that's it's a missile. But, um, yeah, but no pedophilia. <laughs> you know, like we draw the line. Anyway, <laughs> like yeah. my rating is ten out of ten. Uh, invisible fire. Invisible fires. <laughs> uh, is fires. Fire, yeah, ten out of ten. Invisible fires. Fires is one of those things where it's like water. Like, is water ever plural? Like, I'll take. You know, it's like look at all those oceans. What? <laughs> But yes, yeah, ten out of ten fires, 12. invisible fires, oceans twelve. That's too many Ocean. oceans. Is the movie yeah. starting over? What's happening? Oh, <laughs> oh it's a there's end. an ending. Hold on. Oh no! You guys, is this she... part of the move Marvel universe? <laughs> yeah, and then and then uh, then Samuel Jackson shows up. <laughs> right, <laughs> like Rick and Bobby. <laughs> we need you. Oh, look how great uh. these kids turned out. That's why one joined the military. This is unless true. I, unless you don't support war, then what a terrible, terrible thing. <laughs> Goodness. <laughs> All right. Those All right. are... There we go. Oh. Uh, Julia's junk. So I don't know... I have no what? idea where we left off. I'm I think, just going to make a new uh, one. No, no, no. I think, <laughs> I oh, no. Well, last week we said, Tiffany was like, Julia will pull the sound. She does that now. So I hope you have that sound ready to file to go. God damn it. Um, <laughs> do you record them yourself? Like, what? How do, I don't even know what your, your situation on no, that I is. I legit play them. From the podcast? From the podcast. Uh, so let so, me. Wait, so how do you, so do you listen to the podcast and then find it? And then you're just like. Yeah, but that, because I episode, listen to the podcast. Oh, okay. So that episode is up there. I wasn't there last week, though, so it's okay. Because Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Is up. Okay. So our, the week delay really messes you up. It meant, dude, I. <laughs> Why don't you I open. I already up? am jet lagged from yeah. like, not jet lagged, but because I'm in another country. It, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, shit. What? I started playing it. Sorry. Oh, no, um, I mean, for future, why don't you open up uh, Audacity and then just hit like record, do your sound and then stop recording. Then you have it ready for you for next week. Oh, that's true. I don't know. Just suggestion. Yeah. Let me actually open up Audacity. Assuming like you could get it working in the correct manner. But I think that might be like that might be a pretty good uh, solution right? for that. Shoot. Wait a minute. But actually, we did. What? Oh, wait, yeah. Okay, wait, this one was good. Okay, hold on. Wait. Get out of here. This Hamster is what you're known killer. for. This is so from. Uh-huh. He claimed. You know. Don't blame me. Okay. Dorito is by cop? No. Yeah, Gosh darn it. He says this with a Dorito. <laughs> so I don't remember any of this. this nonsense off right now. All right, you guys. Now we're running out of time. This is going to be the next sound. All right, are you ready? Ready. Wait, can you hear that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow, Jared. Okay, wait. 
<laughs> what? It, was that hearable? Oh, I know what it is. It was a little bit soft. Barely. I, I don't think... even remember. Do it again? <laughs> Do it like I don't remember what sound I made, you oh. guys. That's so cool. I have, also it like so gets I think is, Discord is like cutting you off because it's so soft, oh. but it's like kind of sound like water or something like okay, that. Okay, so here, yeah. So um Carpe Badeum, this is the sound from that um episode. Yeah, so this is from um, BB EP forty one. Yeah. Um hashtag. so Tiffany said Vape. hashtag <laughs> Vape. Uh, <laughs> Tiffany said the sounds of waves at Julia's feet while she's learning how to fish sushi with her bare hands from oh, an yeah, old guy. Remember that? Yeah. Um, and then <laughs> Fava Lava said the sound of waves at Julia's feet while she's learning how to fish. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a hmm. minute. Hmm. Is every answer that? <laughs> you might Tiffany, have an issue. <laughs> we relied on you and you copy and pasted the same oh, one no. twice. I don't remember what Fava Lava said. Oh, oh, well. oh well. Sorry, Fava Lava. I don't think he listens um, to the podcast. Whatever. Oh well. Oh, calling you out now. Oh, well. uh, I'll John call Schwartz everyone out. Said, I don't think anyone right? listens to this that that should be. <laughs> uh John Schwartz said green tea because Japan. Fair enough. And then Jared said a bidet. <laughs> oh, that's right. I remember that. So the sound That's where we got the podcast was... title from. Yeah, I remember everything. There you go. The sa- <laughs> I remember everything. Um, the sound it's all was back me. To me. I have no right, longer was... Quest Century oh, anymore. Jared. I'm making right. throwbacks. <laughs> it enhances making... the show. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, it was me because I was having a very difficult time dealing with this episode. So I was drinking a lot of wine. So that was actually the sound of wine sloshing around in the bottle. In your stomach. In my stomach. <laughs> in the bottle, like, not in a, so not your, actually, your hands. <laughs> not, not it was, cu- not it was not in your hands. <laughs> well, this just in, guys, I'm sorry to say, but Up Down Left Eye has not made an Up Down Left Eye wine glass yet, which mm. makes me very sad because but no it, one likes to drink wine out of a mug unless you're awesome. So do it. Get <laughs> yourselves a damn Up Down Left Eye mug and put get, some get, wine in it and drink it. Get yourself a wine mug. Don't you dare try to take my accent, Jared. Nah, I'm doing it too now <laughs> for some no. reason. Why? Are we it's talking? so addictive, right? It's, it's so kind addictive. of fun because you can drag out your <laughs> Paging said he sounds slow. Wait, I yeah, can't wait to listen to this on the slow motion. Oh or no! Slow, slow motion. Oh slow no! Motion. That's gonna sound bad. Oh no! Don't wanna hear that yet. Um. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a new. It's so I can't get. I'm a method actor when it comes to accents. You're a methamphetamine actor. They're pseudofed. Pseudofed. <laughs> pseudofed. 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 Uh, you're, be- you're Pseudo- better fed when you're on certif- certified. Okay. Mm. I'm going to make the mm, I'm gonna make the new sound. Ready? <laughs> Did you get it? Do it one more time. Okay. Hmm. 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 Let me pull up audacity so i can actually i'll give you the <laughs> sound the one more time i'm gonna do the thing because i just I'm, I'm gonna forget it all right <clears throat> okay all right i got that okay i also got me oh, oh, you, i thought you so were going to record it again i was like waiting for you to do it again but you were checking your recording yeah okay, okay. Yeah. so you did get it cool um yes uh oh man I, like i the obvious thing the naive thing would be like if i was a beginner at this game i would say keys like you're jingling your keys but that's wait where that's, are they though are they keys keys i don't well that's the, i don't think they're keys i think that's the amateur keys on the night. Oh, it's, <laughs> i didn't say i didn't Jared. say it th- i didn't say it three times i didn't sh- I sh- <laughs> um shame so I think the naive thing would be to say keys, 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 and you would be like, uh, nice. <laughs> and you'd be like, well, like, what is it? What's on it? And it's like, no, 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 no. It's not keys because that's a very, um, mm. it can't be keys. Mm. It's definitely not keys. It keys, um, keys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just do it. <laughs> just do it again. <laughs> Um, shoot. 
Uh, I'm so, I hate this okay, game. You I'm can, so you bad. Can think, you can okay, think. Okay, yeah, we got um, some answers in chat. I was actually stalling for chat, too. I was like, yeah, I thought, I thought, oh, dang it, I messed I'm it up bad again. at this game. I'm bad at it. I definitely have a hard time coming up with the answers, but I also was like, chat, hurry up. Because I I, like, that's a new uh, thing. I'm not waiting for chat for things anymore. So you can, chat, you gotta says, be on it. Um, right, a container of paper, paper. But the thing is, of uh, paper clips. How many paper clips? Just kidding. Yeah, yeah, we also that. have to guess. It's two things in one. It's a guessing yeah. number game. And, as <laughs> and well if you as... guess it right, you get all the paper clips. But wait, hold on. Wait, guess with the number right? Then we. Huh. So you have to do no, both. Kidding, the... no, please don't. Please don't. I can't keep any of this in my head. Um, nope. Nope. Um, Four. Oh, that's a good number because that's my favorite number. Okay. Wow. Oh. Okay, so I, I, I got it. I got it. I, I've done it. I've done it. I've analyzed you. I understand everything. Oh, fuck. It's Damn it. so your your snack. It's the lid of the ice cream peeled off. I think you folded okay. it up like maybe like three or four times, and then you put it into your up down thigh mug, and you kind of shook it around. Boom. Oh, Mic drop. Okay. <laughs> I hate so this. I hate <laughs> that. <laughs> I don't think I was aware of it, and then, like Tiffany said it once, and now I'm super aware of it, and I hate it. I hate same, it every time. Same. I didn't. I didn't realize like time. Yeah. And then until I heard Tiffany, like, you, when Tiffany the, pretended the, to be me. Yeah, yeah. And same thing. I was like, like, oh wait, right. let me do the thing, and she's yeah. like, okay, and I'm like, God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> so now every time I do it, I can't. Like, you got to do I'm it in here. the accent now. You got to do it in the southern accent though. Okay. You gotta, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was the more the, the, I, <laughs> the Boston, or New Jersey, or whatever. <laughs> I think they all end up messing. <laughs> it's the same um, person. Okay, wait, Jared, you said it's um, the plastic. Who the fudge cakes? Plastic lid of my ice cream. Fold it up. I'm assuming it, you could fold it. <laughs> and put and shook in my up down left eye mug which you can also get an identical one if you want from up down left eye it actually won't be identical because i have to oh, update it it'll be wait, different you guys and, and cheaper thank you monk turner for letting us use oh your my gosh, song evaporated you eric Ding! yes that oh i also i was going to thank other people but i can't remember who i'm supposed to thank. <laughs> i was like we should thank these people i don't remember right oh well Thanks. does anyone else does anyone in chat have an idea or going once i think it's going it, yeah. twice and so old. Cool <laughs> Painting just straight up. Nah. <laughs> nope. She's, I'm out of oh, this. See, I hate this game. I'm sorry. I wrote four paper clips down already. You can't change it. Can't change it. To well, he's five. not asking to change it. He's pretty confident in that answer. I think he's. I no, think he, he said wait. Five paper clips. Oh, wait, I he said, said wait. What? Am I not seeing? Yeah, you're not oh. seeing it, Jared. Oh, it's it's broken. You're broken. Aren't we all your, broken? Your face is moving, but everything else on Rabbit is frozen. Because I, I am rabbit. I can't I click on a rabbit. thing. Oh, so I've, oh, I that chat was done. And the chat is there. Um, anyways, I think that's it, right? We're good? Yeah, that's it. Ah! All right. I'm Jared from Down Thigh. Goodbye. I'm Juri Aguria from Japan. And we had Paint Night. Chiami and Dimba in silent. Hey, thanks. Bye. Vape. Vape. I thought it'd be in like Vocaloid and it'd be like so awesome. It'd be like, your rice is done. <laughs>